Yo! How's it going, folks? Day two. How y'all doing? Hope everyone's having fun playing Zelda. Hope you're all excited for today. We are starting early, because the Eurovision Song Contest is on tonight, so we gotta hop off early. How y'all doing? Yeah, don't worry if you missed day one. Um, we fought the final boss. Uh, now we're just doing the starting area. So really, we're not that far into the game if you think about it. So don't don't worry about it. And we've only died once because we stubbed our toe in the starting area of the game. <laughs> That's it. We jumped into a, a entire lake and we land on the one piece of brick. That was sitting there. That's it. And I've taken that personally to beat this entire thing permadeath now. If we die again at this point, then it's like, it's over, right? It's over. There's no coming back. But until that happens, we're trying not to die desperately. It's on a pixel too. Yeah, it is, it is really unfortunate. Ah. But, yeah, we, we have fought the final boss. We also worked out the entire game's story uh, because we got to the final boss. <laughs> At least we think so. We have theories. And we're going to have fun today. You're not joking? No, no, I am not joking. We fought the final boss. And we didn't die. <laughs> Yesterday was wild. I, I can't believe we pulled it off. We had to call it a drop because we physically ran out of equipment. <laughs> but we didn't die. <laughs> Ah, and today we are gearing up for it once again. We're going to be going a good old while. And I am very excited. Y'all miss so much shit. That's the thing, like, people aren't going to understand, like, what on earth happened yesterday? <laughs> You're gonna be talking about like, what do you mean he's got a long stick? What do you mean he stubbed his toe? And I'm so excited. So welcome back to the Legend of Zelda 2 of the Kingdom. Uh, we fought the final boss yesterday. Uh, today we're gonna do the first area of the game. Uh, we have endgame materials to infuse all of our weapons. Um, we have like 34 attack power stuff. Like, we have so much stuff that we just looted from our expedition. We have like 8 of these 26 attack power items. Uh, we also have, I, I believe, is all the best weaponry in the game. Um, because we can fuse all of this with other things. We also have this whip. I didn't realize how this functions. Look at that. We have insane weaponry. Uh, we also have the most powerful shields in the game. We have the most powerful bow in the game, quite possibly. Uh, and we have a bunch of high-level endgame equipment to work with. Still got the start in armor, still only got seven hearts, but we're gonna work on it. We're gonna try and improve things. Yep, yeah, this is this is our this is our incredible stick. 
It's so stupid. But I love it. Ah, God. Is this already the post game? No, this is the first area of the game. <laughs> we have to go back and um, do the shrines. I don't suppose our horse can hear us. Where is Ario gone? Ario's just like left us. He's all the way over here again. I'm gonna have to walk to this next shrine. Did you get the power glider? I do have the power glider. How'd you beat the final boss? I didn't beat the final boss entirely, but I have fought him. We we did the final dungeon of the game. And we cleared it. And we got so much equipment. Oh, it's one of these guys. Give me money. Give me money. Who's Ario? You, you can tell who missed the stream yesterday. There's like so many questions. <laughs> you, you, listen, you're just gonna have to take my word for it, okay? You can go back and watch the VOD and see it. I'm, I'm not lying. Okay. We're gonna keep going. Yeah, we have a royal bow that we can just use for a while. As much as we want. I mean, like, this is... Insanely powerful in of itself. Like, it, it, it's literally one shot kill and everything, because we're not supposed to have it at this point. That wasn't even a headshot. That wasn't even a headshot. It's just that powerful. <laughs> And the great thing is, we can go back and get all of this equipment as much as we want now, because I know where to go. Like, that that's the best part of it. We can just always have this level of power now. We've essentially broken the balance of the entire game. I do not need this. This is garbage in comparison to what I have. So we'll just leave it. Uh, what I'm still hoping for is better armor. There's a bunch of stuff that would be like of big benefit if we were to find it. Right, the knight's armor is in this. We need to unlock a good fairy fountain too. Are we going shrine hunting today. We're going shrine hunting and I want to go to where the Rito village was. Because there's something to unlock the Great Fairy there. That's kind of like what my goal is at the moment. And the, the direction that I'm trying to get. Now, there's a shrine over here. We still need to get as many shrines as possible because we still try and actively to not die. We have stubbed our toe once. That will be the only death. If I can help it. I should probably equip something that's lower power shield. By which I mean, of course, mean this flamethrower. Yeah, that's the next goal there. Don't mind the blood moon. It's it's all right. He's gonna respawn in a moment. <laughs> Glow of the blood-stained moon shines upon the land. Back to Bloodborne 2. The aimless spirits of slain monsters return to flesh. The Wouldn't the blood moon respond all the loot in the castle? Density. Yes, it does. And we know where the castle armory is now that has all of the best items in the entire game. Like that that's what I mean. We are like we're sorted. We can also, like, we can get there. It's a long, treacherous journey. But we can get down there and we can just grab everything. Whatever we need to refill. Like, there's an extra cannon down there. There's an extra flamethrower. 
Uh, here's like the lightsaber I have. Where's my lightsaber? Like, we can get all of this very reliably because we now know where to go. Yeah, so welcome to day two, gang. Oh, no. <laughs> President Hudson, are you okay? Oh no, what have I done? <sighs> I'm sorry, President Hudson, I won't let you fall over again. Unforgivable, it's all your fault startling me like that. It's just a sign, but I have great respect for President Hus Hudson, so I pin the blame on you. Uh, oh. Mr. Hud like, Hudson was the construction guy, is he the president now? Place him in charge of putting those material caches everywhere, now he's shoulder in Hyrule's restoration. Well, he's also the founder of Hudson Construction, and besides all of that... Oh, he's b rebuilding the entire country. Give me an extra special mission. To put up these signs all over the place to let everyone know that Hudson Construction is a big deal. And your ordinary signs, as you can clearly see. Ah! <laughs> okay, <no. laughs> He's, like, campaigning. Across the land. He's got, like, like his, his little, like, like canvas and posters. <laughs> this guy's just gonna hold this sign forever. The, I got many, so many more signs to spread around. I don't know what to do. Try letting go. Is <laughs> it Hudson? I'll support you. Like this guy. This guy. I don't think this guy is doing too well. I steal this car. I can't steal that one. I can I can build a new cart if I want it. I have some of those wheels for technology. Uh, we do need to check in with a stable at some point because I think we had like enough pony points for something soon. Oh, do we need? Wait, we can just help him keep the sign up. Hang on, let's do this as lazily as possible. Come on. Come on. Yep. What if I just keep that there? That works. I was the president standing. Get him secured while he's still standing. Okay, he's, he's tied it down now. President Hudson is now standing proudly and firmly in place. I my heart with joy to see him doing so well on his own. Have, have okay. some money. I have some dinner too. And here, have a bomb! <laughs> okay, see you later. Oh, God. Yeah, let's continue on our way to the shrine. Break the sign now. I think it's like reinforced, so I don't think I can. It's gonna be like another little like thing to keep an eye on around the world, isn't it? You're gonna have to help him put up signposts. Is that a bit of rock that fell? I don't know if it is. I'm so glad I have the glider again. I, I, I'm never gonna stub my toe again with this. Is this a talus? No, it's not. I mean, it's something that fell. There's a lot of bits of it around here. Rewind the rock. I don't think I can. It's just gonna stay as a as a rock. Hudson said down with the monarchy. 
Welcome to the Republic of Hyrule. We fought a tree. I've, I've ran past the trees, but I've not actually fought one yet. No, I need, I need to go back and do that at some point. The priority is getting the Rito Village and shrines. But we're actively looking for armor more than anything. Armor and heart. So that we can just survive longer in the world. Windy device. Uh, I have, like, something I need to attach a device to. Oh, can I, should I just steal this? I don't think I should. Is it only a fan? Oh, wait, no, I think I see. Okay, hang on, wait, I, I can cause an updraft, yeah. Position that. I'm gonna use this sword for a while, because I think it's like a, one of the weaker ones we have. Okay, hang on. Okay, so I'm, I'm gonna need to position that better. But I mean, the logic's here. Oh, you can just grab it there, perfect. Cool. Take it with us. Okay. They really want us to build a boat. How can we do anything but build a boat? <laughs> I think we have to build it here. Just fly across. Yeah, uh, but I, I need to get these fans over. Come on. Wow, we sure did it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> All right, it comes back. It comes back. <laughs> oh, God. Let's go. Look at us, we're, we're soaring now. There we go. Okay, I need to get in this. Oh, I get it. I think I need to push this up. Yeah, I mean, that, that works. No? No, if you... If you, if you would kindly not attack. that not working it's blowing the right way okay. might just be able to ignore it the stuff here trying to I'm, tr I'm just trying to push it up I guess I can propel it. Not quite enough. Hang on. Super glue this on. 
There we go. Now what we can do is we can jump up here. Don't know what all that stuff is at off at the side. I feel like the, if there's a chest in the shrine, it's in there, isn't it? Yeah, there might be an opal. Can I move this? I don't think I can. Oh wait, there's the chest. Uh, are we asked about this opal? No. <laughs> no, we're really not. Wait, it could be times five arrows. Gosh, shit. Well, thank you for the thousand bits earlier. How's it going, man? Yeah, pick up another quarter. There's so many more pieces of heart to collect. 100% run is ruined. <laughs> oh no, I didn't gather every single Korok across the landscape. How will I survive? Yeah, there's a tower. No, that's, that's the base camp. There's a stable all the way there. That, that, that's the one we were at. I wish I had my horse. <laughs> but Ario hates us. Uh, we could explore more of this starting area as well. Like, I feel like there's going to be like a shrine or two over here. There's the mountain, there's the bottomless pond. The Great Plateau is somewhere down here as well. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna climb this mountain. We we will get to the village. We're just gonna do a little bit of a tour of the region that's already available to us. I think it just makes sense to do. We might find some more cool stuff. Doing this, we don't really need a horse anyway, because we gotta like just walk up mountains. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna explore a while. Look, there's a cool bridge over here. I think there was a boss on that bridge too. We we ran wildly past him. You become the Skyrim horse. I mean, there's got to be something for clearing out this. Let's take down the Happy Band's uh, little camp here. I kind of want to just like slap him around with a barrel, but... Wait, can I... <laughs> You don't see me. <laughs> what was that? Hey, where'd Jimmy go? We can just slap them around now. We 
have a bit of armor too, so not really scared. Oh, sweet. Our first time finding a Boko shield. Yeah, sure. Pick that one up. Already so backwards. We have like end game enemy loot, and now it's the first time. Like, wow, you defeated a Bokoblin. I, like, I. This is garbage. Like. All right, uh, one that just didn't want to detonate. It, you confuse these to th Yeah, this is like the worst idea. If I get like a throwing spear or something, maybe I fuse it. I can't think of any worse plan than like having like a long sword where it's like that's equipped. There's a chest down here. We're gonna go get it. I. Muck this up a little bit. But that's okay, because we have a power. That I can't use. Okay, I've really made a mess of this. Really made a mess of it. That's alright, we didn't want that chest anyway. Oh, yeah, let's go up to the sky, because there's stuff up there too. Awesome. <laughs> Just barely. Alright. Let's calculate it. <sighs> How does Nintendo allow this stream? <laughs> Like, how could Mr. Miyamoto just stand by and let this happen? I'm thinking something's gonna be a talus. Oh my god! <laughs> okay, watch out! This is gonna be a little scary. Oh, we got it. Large Zonite. That's much higher out output than regular Zonite. Okay. It's another currency. To collect. I mean, I mean, this this makes traversal of the land below like a little easier. I think. I can see like a big spotlight at tower there. Fly to the chest now from here. The real mission. I'm trying to see, is there any shrines? I think we're too high up to spot them. That's, that's, the, that's the hole over there. That one's gonna map that area. I don't know if I want to go to that area yet. I kind of want to just go down to this pond. I'm like so unambitious right now. It's like, my god, the world's your oyster. It's like, I want to go in like the map section. Oh! There's something up there in the hillside. Thinking there's something in this tree. Keep an eye out for shrines, Kang. 
Hard to tell where they might be. There's like campsites everywhere. Ancient tree stump. There's something in here. Secret road to Ash Lake. Secret road to Ash Lake. Okay, there's like something over there. Hello, friend. Don't mind me. Oh, there's one of these guys. Hang on, we need we need to get him. No, okay, we're not so interested with you. This fella. He drops the blubble metal. I need to collect these. Bubble gem. This game is so pretty. It it is. Like I I kind of love it. I, I love how there's so many caves and interiors now, because it's something that Breath of the Wild, like, you kind of noticed it didn't really have. It was like a man versus wild vibe, like, just most of the time. Oh, I have something that can work here. Hang on. Flamethrower. I, I love these areas. They do make me nervous compared to like the base game because you, you you can't really escape anywhere if something goes wrong. Especially with like the like likes everywhere now. Like they're they're horrifying. Like some kind of flag in here. Spear. Oh, this might actually be bad. Hang on. Yeah, I should probably just ascend. I gotta stop taking stupid risks while I'm like over bodies of water. <laughs> There's still more of the flags there. I'm gonna have a base in here? I didn't just miss something by going down the tree and then like there was something right there, did I? Hope not. Take more of these. We got we gotta explore the abyss later. Okay, uh Oh, there's something in here. Flamethrower. You know what? I'm gonna treat myself. I'm just gonna have a royal guards, royal guard shield equipped until I need something else. Why not? Yeah, what's in here? Fierce deity boots. Oh, okay. These were really rare in the base game. Well, like hard to find. Just inside a tree here. Here, fierce deity boots. I'll I'll take it. I'm not complaining. That's like a permanent attack up as long as I got these equipped. Okay. You jump out from here. Were these exclusive to amiibo or something? Were they? I. They might have been like one of the DLC items. I know there was like quite a bit. 
Oh, I spy a Korok. Hang on. Did it. I have to scan some of the amiibo because I have quite a few of them. I need, I need to see what they give me too. Thanks, Korok friend. I mean, that that was pretty cool area. Yeah, we, we went quite a bit there. There's another shrine all the way over there. Maybe... Oh my god, that's pretty, that's pretty fair. Okay, we're gonna... Yeah, we're sticking to this area. We're gonna have to go area by area. Otherwise, like, this game is gonna be overwhelming to play. And there'll simply be too much happening. So like we're gonna we're gonna try go area by area. Let's go to let's go to the base on the hill next. And see what there is. And then we'll go to like the bottom right of this map. Three whole Hyrule size maps is insane. Yeah, like there's so much. I got that one? I've got that one. If it's green, does that mean it's cleared? How do, you, how do you tell anymore? I guess it's blue on the map. They were like orange and blue before if they hadn't cleared them. But yeah, like there, there's just so much to unpack. That it's like we have to have some kind of system or like it, it, it's just too much. The map is insane. Yeah, we've probably missed like a couple of sky access points. There's definitely something up there. You can see like the giant tornado. Let's go up this go up this hill here. I been to that shrine. Yeah, I'm looking directly at it, okay. Thoughts on Australia. <laughs> Shout out to Australia. That's a country where, like, like, the land and creatures are trying to kill you at any moment's notice. But you're all li li still living there. And, like, like, you're just like, fuck it, we'll make it work. Hardy, this fuse, this fuse, oh, fuse attack power is one, it's weird seeing it, yeah, I was thinking, hang on, that's not what Hardy Truffle does. I mean, I can, I can break into the fort from here. I think that's what I'm supposed to do. Inconspicuous space here. like a prisoner. Hang on. <laughs> Gotta take the loot first. Hinox hammer. Um, I can drop this because it's gonna break anyway soon. Amber. Do we just leave this guy locked up? <laughs> Be like, don't even free him. Oh wait, you've got armor! That's new! Oh god. Don't want to get near those. Come on. We have armor. It can't just immediately kill me. 
Crucially, I have a bow. Ow! Hang on, let me. I, uh, I I can make quick work of his armor. <laughs> oh, the explosives! <laughs> God, the explosives are gonna get me killed. Okay, how how do I break through his defense? I can. I have my ice magic. Doesn't work. How do I break through his defense? Oh, you ju okay, you just hit him. He's got like an armor help value. That's interesting, that's new. Goblin camp clear. I do have a lightsaber as well, yeah, maybe, maybe I should just use that. I just... Aha! <laughs> oh, nice salt! Take some food supplies. Yeah, I'm, I'm scared of the explosives, there's, there's a lot of them here. Oh, I need to fuse that on a weapon. These one, these ones require like Zanai devices. What, what, what could I pop it on? If I take this off. <laughs> there we go. It like grows in size from like when you take it out off your back. Oh, Boko Bo, finally encountered that one. Okay, wooden shield, but shield guard is up. Ah, oh, but durability is up on this one. Dur durability is like so valuable considering how. Everything appears to be breaking more. There you go. You're saved. I wonder how I got here. Do you want to explain? I must tell you about the Blood Moon. Oh, do they like respawn? He's just studying the moon. I have, I have, I have my dinner. They're giving some really good rewards for doing the side quests of like food items and that. I feel like they were like few and far between in Breath of the Wild. They've really ramped it up. They want you constantly fighting. I, I, I mean, I think that is the logic. Is that all that takes? It's just a lizard and a horn? That's really good. We want to make all of those. That's so good. That's such a simple recipe. That's like just a two piece. Blue lizards, lizards are rare. Maybe, but we can like just set them aside for that now. You know? Like that that's that's still like an insanely good one. It's, it's two things. Just have 26 golden hearts so you can never die again. But like, we could just make the ultimate hearty recipe. I'm I'm okay with that, yeah. If we get enough hearty food, we can just compound it all. And never die. 
Okay, there's ranch ruins over here. In the bottomless pond. We want we want to just check out this area over here. So we're gonna travel to here in a promo. It's time for durians. I, th I think durians spawn like the rainforest area of this game. We'll get them though. Yeah, we will. I I I I'm determined to not die again. I'm I'm okay with it, like stupid stubbed his toe death. Well, I, I think I can actually do it without another death. But we got to the goddamn final boss. <laughs> you know, at this point, all I need is equipment. Ah, thank you for the kind words. Thank you very much. Basil fruit. Ranch runes are here. I'm, st I'm just looking for shrines, though. Open this one over here. Don't mind me. And inventory slots. I, I, we need to find Hestu. Like he's out in the world somewhere. If I had to guess, he'd be ba back by the Korok forest. That one's marked on my map for where that is. Here's what's left of Lamon Ranch. <laughs> Buddy. I get out of here. Please get Ario. I, I will eventually. Just doing a little explore. Yeah, it's cool seeing areas like this. This is just Lon Lon Ranch. Macarena of Time. There's your fire fruit peddler. The seen better days. Still trying to construct it, reconstruct Hyrule. I'm excited, like, because I, I think, like, they're probably going to do a third game or something at some point. You know, everything comes in, like, trilogies and threes these days. I would love to see another one where it's, like, this world again, but it's, like, it's actually reconstructed more. And just what happens then. There's a cave next to Lon Lon Ranch now. Buddy! <laughs> Bonked. My worst nightmare is you go through like a passage like this and it's like immediately like there's a like like or something. I think those might be my least favorite enemy. Fight. Is it just free loot? Game's not very well protected, is it? Why do I keep doing it like this? I, I have a power up to jump. I can't. Ascend really is gonna be the one that like I just forget that exists. It's no Cryonis. Like there's no reason for me to just neglect it like this. Because it actually is pretty good. It has way more applications. Hey, bud. It seems to be one of these in every cave. You get more inventory space. I'm, I'm actively trying to. Oh, it checks off the cave if you've explored it properly? Apparently I missed something in there. That's cool. I always, I, I love stuff like that for just like completion's sake. I missed something in that other cave.
Hello, friends. Just pilfering all your supplies. I need so many more arrows. Like, I'm constantly running out of them. This way. Okay, we have to do a little explore. Head in over here next. <sighs> Did you ever do a 100% run in this game? I, I I don't think this game is fun to 100%. Like, Breath of the Wild wasn't either. Like, you can get all the Koroks, but like... Why, you know, why would you? <laughs> I guess it's torture. But I'm gonna just enjoy it. You know, I, I want to do everything in the sense actually see everything that the game has to offer. So like, you know, do shrines. Temples and shit. But if it's like, if it's like doing like 100% to just like torture and complete a checklist, then no, that's, that's not fun. You know? Like, you'd ruin the game for yourself by doing that. I don't think it's intended for, like, someone to want to do that anyway. Would you try speedrunning this game after you finish it? I was speedrunning this yesterday, right? Like... <laughs> Let's be real here. We already worked out the the route. Like I just need to do it fast now. Run. Like for me, like yesterday alone, like has put this on par with like the permit that run for me now. Just just straight up. Like that that was insane. I was concentrating so hard for that fight. This rock just fell. Here we go. Uh, let me know if you see any shrines. How high up is this? I mean, I can, I can maybe fly to that one. Is that a shrine? I, I'm too high. There's one there. Okay, I, I don't have enough stamina to get over to that one. Did anyone see a shrine on this bit of the map? More of like the Nazca lines over there. Probably want to get that too. That's why we're here. Anyone see anything over the lake? Yeah, the, the shrines are marked with green, like, like, so there is one over there. We haven't marked for some reason, so we might as well get that one in a moment. Yeah, and then there's probably one down by the lines down here. There's one, that's the one on the island. Yeah, let's go to the lines. Uh, and we'll go to the lines by climbing this and flying. Basically, yeah, we're just trying to get, like, as many 
shrines as possible currently. Did you spell fuck yet? <laughs> no, I haven't. I've, I've been slacking. Oh, watch out. He's, he's just dead from above. That's scary. Oh, stuff might just drop a bomb on us and kill us at any point in time. I don't like that. I think for this, I just need to ascend. Once I get near it. Go pick up another shrine. With the stadium lights. Okay. Alright, the fuck game. What is happening? Just just running. Just running away. What the fuck was that? Why did, like, hands just pop up? There's something there. What is that? More dark clumps. Is that the wall master? I think that's what those guys are based off of, yeah. You had hand enemies in old Zelda games that would just like drag you below or something. Oh, not you. Oh wait, I can just climb this. I think that's what I'm supposed to do. Oh no, but it's, I... Of course, it's the legend of rain at inconvenient times. Okay, well, we might as well sit tight a minute. Not like a rock I can ride up. Can't quite ascend, it's, it's a little out of reach. We gotta find the umbrella. Most important item in the game. You ascend through the route. I... <laughs> be kinda shocked. Yeah, it, it, it's, it's too high, unfortunately. You just swim into that branch. Yeah, the rain, the rain will pass in a few. This could be an ASMR stream, just rain in Zelda. It is quite peaceful, isn't it? Should have kept the spring shield. Uh, yeah, you're right. Let me like, let me keep like the trampoline shield over the seventy royal guards shield. <laughs> Seems like a good decision. Right, it should clear up soon. You can see like the weather forecast. And we can go over to the lines there to pick up the tier of the kingdom. Um, we could explore this. We could actually explore this zone. We've already got a lot of the shrines in it too. If we do that zone too on top of the Rito Village. What happened to Ario? Ario is just not returning our calls. Ario is very far away.
put a bomb in your shield and then bomb jump. That seems like a sound, safe thing to do in a trying not to die run. What if I just strap an explosive to my body and see what happens? Just curious. I think I can make this. Let's go slow. Let's go slow. I don't think I can make it. I think I need some stamina. I actually, I actually can't make that. Don't, I don't have any stamina food, unfortunately. I have, like, go fast. I gotta let go just so I can safely, like, glide to the bottom. Yeah, I'll have to come back after I do some cooking. I, I just can't. We need stamina food. I, I need to get stamina food and, like, max, extra maximum hearts. Just keep me alive forever. You have a cooking pot? I only have one. I, I don't really want to use it yet. It might just be a cooking pot over, like, the stable or something here. There was one uh, near the last set of lines. Just, just continue on a merry way. It should be alright. Oh, we gotta help this guy with the sign again. This is this is actually gonna be a puzzle. This is gonna be a puzzle throughout the land, isn't it? Okay, okay. let's just start, um... Cello tape and stuff together. Yeah, don't don't worry, friend. We're gonna we're gonna get your sign nice and sturdy. Yo, using some quality build materials. You can, you can let go of the sign now. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, the, that a problem solved. Yeah, give us your money. Meaty rice balls. A sleepover ticket? Reward for collecting pony points. Spend at the stable that we get some rest and recover the fatigue of travel. Okay. You have to pay the night or something. <laughs> this is like just abominate. Just... Problem solved in the kingdom. Okay, so we're gonna we have to look for Impa, I think. Near this, and we need to find a dragon tier. We just we just need a way to look above it, and we're looking for like the eye. How you doing, friends? 
What? Oh my god. What? It's a battle talus. They're mobile. <laughs> That's new. I, I can't even get up. They've built like scaffolding. Um, can I burn it? No, I, I guess I gotta. I it's just ascend, isn't it? Yeah. Okay, so hit the weak spot. Jump on up. Ow. <laughs> Not very. Oh, he's no, he's strong. <laughs> oh. I gotta, just, I gotta just shut up and fight. I gotta just beat them. Don't say anything. Okay, that's a that's a wild spin on an enemy. That's part of like a little camp treasure chest too. Not even like a, its own unique contained thing. That's so different. I kind of love it. They always drop a talus heart now, it seems, too. Which you can then just, like, infuse on a weapon. Of your choosing. I, I, I think I probably want to infuse this on a shield. Maybe see what it does. I mean, it ups its attack. I don't know if that helps me, though. Heart shield. I guess for a parry, it, it will help. The topaz, yeah, so like these, these gems are so much more valuable because we need these for magic. Probably not going to sell any of them by like opals and amber and that. Regular gems, though, like they have like extra functionality. We keep everything as materials until I actually need to like spend some money. Oh, we just found the eye. Maybe there isn't always a hot air balloon. Yep, let's get some more lore and see if our theory's tr true. We get the right bits of lore. Oh, hello! <laughs> He's just straight up here? Hyrule will bow down before me. First, here's a little ditty. Summoning the worms. Bodugar are approaching our position. It's more than we thought. It's a swarm! 
Zelda's just here in this time, yeah. happened yet, but Zelda's been sent back in time, as far as we can tell. We're trying to piece together the story. Oh, that's pretty good. <laughs> that blast wiped out all the Molduga. How is that possible? Look at all the crafting materials. So brute force will not be enough. The secret stone of the Zonai. <laughs> How interesting. So Ganon's hatching a plan. Still not sure what's going on though. It doesn't really help us fill in some of the blanks. But we'll get there. I don't know how many pieces of lore there's gonna be like this. Like, uh, for memories in Breath of the Wild, there was like... I think it was 12? Scattered across the land? There's 18 here. Some of these might be story-based ones, too. Interestingly, number one as a memory is gone. Number two is the first one. I'll have to keep an eye out. I think I saw a rock fall from here as well. Isn't that a set of lines? Something here? Oh, this is this is a Korok. Hang on. I'm trying to just make the cube whole. There we go. Hestu, where are you? I need weapon slots. Okay, and then there was something that fell? Was this here? Uh, this is gonna be a funky one though, because it hits the tree. Oh god. <laughs> oh, I see. So that, that that's to help you find the eye. There's there's another one straight up over there. Okay, let's go towards That's a stable life Benna, isn't it? Now, where, where are we going towards? There's nothing in the bottomless pond. Go back towards the blue one. Because I think there's like a stable over there somewhere. We're not going too far this direction. I want to get over this way. Where 
the fuck is Ario? <laughs> Alright. Yeah, we're going to that blue one there. Ah, oh, God. Say how massive this game is. Like, I mean, Breath of the Wild was the same, but like, there seems to be so much more here between like the caves, the underground, the sky. Like, they've basically taken Breath of the Wild and built on top of it, and made it like a whole new game. But the geography seems mostly the same. Like, you still have like all the same mountains and rivers and whatnot. But yeah, I mean, I mean, this, this, just the scale of it all is, is great. Like, I love it. Oh, these guys might have something in the well. Do you see it? That's pretty strong. Like, they fleshed out a lot of the, even these areas. Like, there's, there's just entire sequences. Places to go. I need, I need something a little faster. It, aha! The Light Spear! Go, oh, my handy torch! And then I can use this to smack through that. That's another fire power up at some point. Is there always one of the blue guys in every cave like this? Don't know if there is. This is marked as a well. Chest here. Yep. The boomerang. I. I don't have anything I can toss. I. I need. I need a weapon slots. else down here? You guys sure that like there would always be like a, a blue thing even in here? Doesn't feel it for this one. Like I think this is it. Blowing cave fish. Dive below the water, you can't do that. That's, that's just not a mechanic. Yeah, I, I don't feel like there's anything else. I don't think, maybe it's not true for Wells. Maybe it just doesn't apply. Okay, but we're figuring that, like, that kind of stuff out as we go. You know, it's like, it's, it's an adventure. You can swim through the earth, but not underwater. <laughs> Listen, I- I don't make the rules, okay? <laughs> it's a little weird when you put it like that, but... You know, like, Mr. Miyamoto probably took some great inspiration about a time he, like, swam in a desert or something. And went through the sand. 
tends to be how it goes. So, there's one over here, and it's next to a stable, so we can pick this up. Have there been any Lionel spawns? Uh, yeah, I found a white Lionel. <laughs> and I jumped on his back and attacked him. Uh, before we realized... All hope is lost. And so, we have to backtrack on that plan. It's also a corrupted Lionel, so it's like even harder than a regular Lionel. No one's gonna believe me, and I can see it in chat. I, I I can see it's like, what do you mean he did that? And there's like there's another camp that's like, well, technically he already died, so he shouldn't even be tried to survive. <laughs> God damn it, we're, we stubbed our toe once, so I'm gonna make the rest of it. Show proof or not real. Watch yesterday's stream. It's all there. He's dreaming. Board force. We need a ball. We get in the ball. Just straight up molten lava. Oh. Okay, am I... Are we just making a car? I already have a car, honestly. Okay, that, that's not a good spot to put it. I hope this- does this do lava? Okay, it does. Up you go, friend. <laughs> oh my god, I can So we need we need to get it up here next, right? So here's my plan. If I <laughs> if I can just make a, enough of a wedge. I, I can just pick it up. Got that through there. Drop this down here. Um. Okay, I think I see what I can do. Uh, I think I see the solution before me, right? No, that, that one's not big enough. Ah, of course, there's other- there's other parts here. So, what I'm gonna do... Is if I take this boy... And we're gonna glue it on here.
We need a slightly longer car. We need a slightly longer car. Okay, hang on. Alright. There's another raft here. Yeah, we just need to get across ourselves now. Which we can do via here. People said they saw a chest. Was it down there somewhere? Chest in the water. Oh, I see it. Okay. Question is how do I how do I get this forward? Can't drag it if I'm on it. What if I just activate the wheels? <laughs> okay, not a good idea. <laughs> Thank you for the thousand bits. Okay, so what I can do now is I can drag that along with me after I activate the backup raft. Uh, let's just get the treasure chest that's below this contraption here. Have space for it. Maybe I make space for it. Th these ones are pretty good. Maybe it's time to lose the spear spear. The Zonite ones are really good if you like attach them to stuff. Like for instance, like, if I take this wheel, right? Got like a big old club. <laughs> big wheel club. Oh, but the spear spear is kind of it's kind of amazing, isn't it? All right, I'll, I'll keep the spear spear. I have to use this up though, okay? <laughs> Uh, this isn't working. Okay, uh, I do have an idea for this, though. So, I'm gonna pop this as far along as I can. The idea is that I can now stand on that. Okay, I gotta do this quick. Hang on. Now we can get this further along. <laughs> mm. It's not it's not working the way I intend it. What if I just pass it up there? Stop it from driving. I could just make enough like wreckage. Oh, this this is this is this has to be a solution actually. Hang on. If I like make enough of an obstacle course. Oops. 
then it's not going to be like physically possible to flow flow back. I did it. <laughs> Oh, the fucking jingle if you solve the puzzle this way. <laughs> it's like, yes, my god, you solved it. <laughs> puzzle solved. Look, it works, right? Oh, you just take the ball off. There's no one solution. <laughs> I am an engineer. I, I I studied engineering before I went for my English degree. Before college. Picked all my subjects in relation to it. Stepped away from it in the end. This fella wasn't for me. But you know, you can still see some remnants of it. I'd love to see you play Polybridge. I have played Polybridge. You can find videos of that on, on YouTube. Oh, God. The wetland stable. Don't attack the chickens. I, I need to make some stamina dishes if I can. Do I have- I don't have anything that gives stamina, do I? A party truffle is always a good one to cook, because this just gives you... Yeah, full recovery, and then plus one. Got a gloom-resistant effect. I don't really have anything that's gonna work here, do I? The bomb flowers- cooking bomb flowers doesn't do anything. Yeah, cook a fairy. I do have a fairy. I don't have the lizards that I need for um the potion. I have Gibdo bones. Forty fuse attack power, but they break easily. That's like a one and done. Ah, well, thank you for a thousand bits. Is the selfie before the final boss still in your album? I, I think so. We did have to reload the save uh, to like, get out of it. Yeah, I, I need I need stamina mushrooms. Like, I don't actually have much extra that's going to help me here. A lot of cooked stuff on me at the moment. We need to get to a shop and just uh, get some food ingredients. Maybe Beetle might have what we need. It's got frogs. Elixir for maximum stamina? It's a hundred a frog, though. That's a lot. I probably want his arrows. Yay! Um. Offers resistance to flames. There's usually, like, oh, some point where you need those. Just pick them up now. Ever heard of Papalo Volcanus? It's what you call a smolder wing when you're doing science with it. Well, smolder wing butterfly is a lot easier to say. Wow! Oh, he knows, he knows his stuff. Buy some frogs. <laughs> Not gonna buy the tireless frogs just yet, because I don't have much money. He loves his bugs. Oh, 
Oh, I need to. I got. This lightning rod's gotta go. There we go. Hi. Ooh. Oh. Add one point for the pony points. Sure. Oh. So you got some points saved up, Link. Oh. Okay, I'm gonna take out Ario. Oh. Ario's not the strongest, but Ario is really good in everything else. Oh. Hmm. Okay, horse with a lot of stamina. I heard about the trouble in Zora's domain. All that good water polluted by some kind of mysterious muck. It does it does feel like it's like the same issues in that before as like in the base game. It's weird. It's like new but so familiar. Okay, receive reward. A towing harness. A durable harness that comes as a set with a horse saddle. Attach a wagon or other objects to the harness for a horse in to tow. Oh. Horse God Fabric will be yours. One kind of item you can bring to the Hatno Village Dye Shop. Horse Harness? Do I... Do I just drop it? I'm not sure. You can drag a Korra. <laughs> Is it from the drop menu, maybe? No, it's not there. Do I fuse it to just to the horse? <laughs> no, are you? Aria! Please! Okay, we got Aria back. Oh. Customize horse. Oh. So you can just add the harness. Question, like, if I don't add a harness, is... <laughs> it's just gonna be dry. Hey, how's it going? Put me on this way. I heard there are strange rooms in Kakariko Village. By strange, I mean ring-shaped. Okay, so everything everything has changed. Is there a carrot I can steal? <laughs> Not seeing any carrots. Make one. We don't. We don't even have like the materials for it to make one. Moment. Okay, but we'll 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 keep that with us. Um, we can eventually get a wagon together. Sure. <laughs> Let's just drag that with us, just in case we find one. There's a lot more of these blue rabbits. Oh, there's a cave there, too. You know, we might want to hop in there. There's another well. Hey, how's it going, man? Wait a long time for some of the rescue bees. My own dared fall them here though. Drop some down the well and climbed in after it. Oh, the ladder uh, broke. Uh, 
Okay, we can we can slap on some glue. Ah. Well, good luck with that, buddy. Oh, this is this is a weird ladder. There you go. Ah. Ah. Let's get out of here. <laughs> Burn the ladder and leave. More money's good. Oh. Going to catch up with my buddy Jorah and head to the Foothill Stable so we can apply for the Zunai Survey Team. Ah. Oh god, the ladder! <laughs> oh, the Macy escaped when he did. <laughs> oh no. That could that could have gone really badly. There we go. Let's just murder them all here. Don't have anything equipped. Hang on. Good fight. They're just doing pull-ups. Yeah, like they're just exercising. Oh, roasted bass spear. <laughs> sure. The ultimate weapon. Yeah, this is badly damaged, but we'll get our mileage out of it. Oh, diamond is just 25 attack power. That's really good. We can find those a little bit more. Maybe above ground in that. You can make a diamond sword. Minecraft is here. I need to find something to fuse to this still. Have any good sticks? Rock sledge. Just a long stick. Wait a bit. Find something nice. Wait, let me remember that this power up exists. <laughs> Had a little bit of trouble because of that blip. Let's remember a second time. He's learning. Soldier spear spear. Even the game is like doing our play style now. <laughs> Let's get him, boys. Spear spear. We're gonna use up our own spear, spear. The game is sentient. Run. And that cave is now... Okay, wait, the cave is not checked off. Is there something else down here? That's what I don't get sometimes. Sometimes they check off a cave, sometimes they don't. There's something up here. It really is a frog. <laughs> A 
Yeah, he was just trying to exist down here. We're just like coming along to murder him. Okay, right, we'll we'll use up the royal bow first. Is it checked off now? Yes, it is. Okay. I appreciate when games do stuff like that just to help you find shit easier. <laughs> Look at all this. You really hurt him. Okay, here comes Ario. Wait and tow. I hope it doesn't slow down Ario to just be lugging this. <laughs> I'm worried we're gonna like snag a rock or something. And just like completely fall over. <laughs> We need to get back. We're supposed to be exploring this side of the map. Yeah, here. <laughs> Let's just depart from Ario just one moment. We'll get Ario back at the stable, don't worry. I need to take the saddle off. Why Ario doesn't listen to you? Hey, yeah, no. I never talked to this guy apparently when I was here last. Customize horse. Grab Ario. You make your horses carry siege engines now. Yes, like potentially I can. I want like a battleship that we can have Ario like be like the power source of. <laughs> like pull and tow. Okay, delete delete these pins for now. Okay, this continent is our next mission. We're gonna go <laughs> north because there's a shrine up here first. Ruins. Is this? I vaguely remember this. Being in the game before. This location. A lot more ancient ruins. Okay, we're exploring. We're getting more shrines. We're gonna go area by area. Can I just. guys just trying to exist. The range you even get on this is great. Don't don't anger the bees. Okay. So that's the border. So we're going to go up along here. Fuse bees. What? What does that accomplish? Maybe like the bee sword. Cross the border without a license. I'm trying not to, just so I can like actually explore each area. But I, I, my my brain needs a way to like kind of break down locations like this. Otherwise, it's simply too much. Does that make sense? I don't think I'm alone in that. There's a shrine over there. Ooh, we're going over there. Pick 
picking up every star fragment we see. Keep me friends. I'll help you with that sign in just a moment, my man. I, I actually remember this area from Breath of the Wild now. This is like such a lighter game area, but we're going here first this time. I need to pick this up real quick. And unlocking the map, you better visual indicator for where the border is. Yeah, I mean, if, I mean, of course, but I'm I'm gonna get it. We have we have the border marked still. Yeah. Dipping out for a moment without a passport, we should be okay. Huh. Star fragment. We're gonna use these for something amazing. Don't know what it is yet. But I, I know it'll be good. I think there's a there's a temple down that chasm as well, isn't there? It was like full of guardians, like in the first game. I remember it. It was like a, there was like one of the harder dungeons in the game. Let's get this shrine first. Is that a crimson well. Get the get the shrine first. If you attach a star fragment to a weapon, I don't know if it has actually yeah. even like a good fuse attack stat. Might be okay though. Might do something. And we go. The hell is that weapon? You can just tell who's new in chat. It's it's funny to me. I keep glancing over. It's just like, wait, what the fuck? <laughs> Fire and ice. Uh, okay, I see what's happening here. Let me make this a little smaller, so it fits in here. Then we go on over here. Um. <laughs> Just, uh. <laughs> it's not. Working the best, is it? Oh, it's because this cube survived. Little cube. Guessing I need to get this back. Doesn't want to fall. Doesn't want to go. Oh, I just have to slide that back. I think I could just fly back here. Okay. Makes more sense. I thought I had to, like, be on the cube.
Hello, RT game. Your chat rules say be calm and polite. Please do the same. I don't expect to hear swearing on a Sunday. <laughs> well, thank fucking Christ it's not Sunday. Like, Jesus. Could you imagine? Completely understandable. Yeah, no swearing tomorrow. We'll just uh, fucking get it out of our systems today, then. <laughs> um, where, where am I actually putting this block? Is there something up there? Oh, if only I had a power-up that let me ascend, if you will, to check. Um, where? Is there like another left or something? I just don't see it. Oh god, okay, the, the fire, that, that's the lever. Oh, so we need to bring that, that block back. Okay, I got it. And we put it on top of the ice. The slides. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm going to need another block of ice. And then I gotta fasten these immediately. This still isn't hot. There we go. Ice block has a hat now. Oh, sorry. My sneeze are so loud. I wish I could mute in time. Ugh. My sneezes are so violent. <laughs> Actual bad sneeze. Yeah, thanks for the blessings, guys. The older I get, the more aggressive that sneeze will become, too, so you better- you better be careful. Like, I'm just gonna scream in future. When I have to sneeze. Like, it'll just be full on, like, ah! It levels up as he gets older. It's true. This needs will become equipped with artillery. You're gonna charge it like a Dragon Ball Z character? <laughs> like, what does that even mean? Yep. Oh, God. Okay, so I remember there was a big ass temple in this chasm in Breath of the Wild. I want to see if it's still here, because I think if this is going to be- there might be a shrine down here. There is also the Corrupted Well, which is kind of freaking me out.
Have a look. I don't know if I want to go down here. This this seems re. Oh no. Can't see shit. There could be ground below me. There could just be like a clay, a, a f cliff in front of me. Go slow. Just activate the light source. It's straight up just an entry point to here. Uh, it's not the worst thing to find though, because we're actually almost, we almost have enough uh, Poe souls for the tunic. We can just grab like a few of these while we're down here. Poe's. I wouldn't say no to the Dark Link tunic. is amazing on this. We're quite far away from everything else, too. I even map it out so that you can, like, hop over bits of it. Yeah, we'll, we'll venture over to this one here. See if we can get enough Poe Souls and then we'll, like, get out of here. Another statue. I, I don't know what the deal with the statues is going to be yet. Or if I need to take pictures of these. Like, I need it to for one side quest. There's been nothing else indicating what the purpose of this region is. I feel like there's going to be, like, some huge unlockable. We absolutely want to get down here. But I'll be damned if I know what it is. Because there must even be more to do with the post souls. Because, like, we, we've torn through the unlocks for these. Like, there's only one big one, it seems. You know? Need just a few more. If I take that reinforced traveler's sword, there the spear, spear. And what I'm gonna do is, if I infuse this. Like, what, what if we just make, like, the ultimate sword? Okay, like, like th this is gonna be amazing. <laughs> look how co look how cool this is. He's the Grim Reaper. Like this attacks so quickly. Okay, so that that's now our best weapon. We're gonna we're gonna keep that in the wings. I think the idea is instead of slapping two old weapons together, you always want to take like an old weapon and then just give it like a new blade that is a monster part. It's, it seems to be like the general idea. Which is a very cool little gameplay loop. I, I I love how many systems they've introduced like this. Yeah. 
Okay, we, we have enough pose souls. I think maybe we just get out. I, I don't know if there's like shrines down here to find or like pieces of heart or like anything. I don't know what the point of it is yet. Which is why I'm like fascinated by it. Let's just uh, go back out, because our, our, our investigation here was for the temple. And so what we're going to do, we'll get the Dark Link tunic. And we can hop on back. That temple. Yeah, I, like, we're going to launch, like, expeditions in that entire area just as we get more hearts. And they all correspond with a shrine location. So for every shrine, there's like a similar location on the ground that you have to map. Don't know what it does, though. If you light it all up. Really want to see, though. I hope to do with the sign, too. I, I will. I will. I'll, I'll come back for him. I only have 50 for the battery at the moment. Pose. A dark tunic? Get it. Turn the lost spirits to the afterlife. Brighter in locations. Oh, okay, that's different. Let me get some more pose in. There's more specific objectives. They might have different rewards. Yeah, that's what I'm thinking. <laughs> Look at our, like, edgy anime ass. <laughs> We're so cool. We have a Reaper weapon as well. I'm gonna listen to like some like Linkin Park. As we annihilate Ganon. How far into the game are you? Uh, not too far. We've only fought the final boss. We're just doing the initial areas now. Hope that clears it up. Okay, here's another into it. Oh, we mapped this one? We mapped this one. Porch. Have you got the lizards for me, Beetle? No lizards. He's got more arrows, though. I feel like I should just buy the bundle. Whenever I see it. Could also do like a, I'll take the lot. Nah, it should be good for now. I, I, I have enough. <laughs> it's just like piercing the tent. Like, sorry. <laughs> Ripping a hole with it. Not much of a wagon, you say? Hang on. Hey, hands off. So that'll be a beautiful horse-drawn wagon. Well, I'm fixing it. Yeah. <laughs> I was trying to help you. <laughs> the fixer-upper. <sighs> oh, okay, so you, you need to give them a horse. Might let me do it now. There's one. 
Uh, I'm not giving the Mario. Uh, I will. I will catch another horse. How long does this glue hold as well? Bro, my thanks for hundred bits. Is that a halberd weld onto another halberd? Yep, yeah, it's a long halberd. A brand new wagon with wheels and everything. Only one step away from having my dream of having a horse-drawn wagon. Does anyone anyone see a horse? That's not Ario. Does anyone see Ario as well? Where the fuck have they gone again? Oh, it's because I'm not at the right- I'm not at the right one. What's up here? You keep losing Ari. I don't know, she just keeps running off. Well, I'm at the wrong shrine. Yep, so it's my fault in part this time. I, I need to get, like, the, the teleport harness or something like that. That just brings your horse to you. Like, she could have heard me. She could have heard me. I can see her. And now she's coming. Hey Arya, how you doing? There's a big, huge temple in this cliff that I remember in the base game. It was one of the hardest shrines, just because I had so many guardians. I wanted to see if it's still here in some capacity. I can see the roof of it. Yeah, this, this, this is it here. See? An entrance over here. I'm gonna see if we can still hop inside it. What's happening? Massive old place. Thirty minutes later, where the fuck is Ario? <laughs> yeah, we're gonna lose her again. I can already tell. <laughs> I'm gonna forget. <laughs> Forgotten temple. Is a way in here. I thought it was that before. Maybe it's further down. Oh yeah, there's someone here! Lady Impa. Pleased to see that you've come here as well. To be honest, Lady Impa deduced that there's something related to the geoglyphs here. Some effort for us to get up here, but we managed to. Lady Impa grew impatient. The moment I took my eyes off her, she went... Deep into the temple all by herself. Oh, this- yeah, she did actually mention this, didn't she? It's so much calmer here now. I compared them before. I'm gonna have to just slice these open. Before, when you'd enter this, like, you'd hear, like, the, the Guardian music playing. They'd all be taking pot shots at you immediately. That was just nice and calm.
fucking top of here. This is what I mean, like, it's like, the game is like new, but also so nostalgic already. It feels weird to say nostalgic, like, it's not even that old. Sturdy thick stick. Um... Do we have any weapons that kinda outright suck? All of our weapons are pretty good. Well, we, we have- okay, we have the spear spear. <laughs> We might need to sacrifice the Spear Spear soon. No, not the Halbuller bird. The Halba bird. It's like a Final Fantasy spell. Never the Spear Spear. That's the best one. Okay, we, we need to find Hester then. We have to find Hester. We simply don't have the space. Carry on like this. Oh. I think I want that. Here is too good. We not get more stamina. Uh, I mean, we can, but we also need more HP. We're still playing it on try not to die. HP is like the most important thing. Oh, this is a shrine in here. We, we all we always kind of have to go HP. Stamina is like definitely a quality of life thing more than anything. Okay, we'll talk. Talk to Impa in a moment. Let's check in here real quick. Building blocks. It's gonna be like another Rubik's Cube one. go. You just gotta line it up. You beaten Radan yet? <laughs> you know, we, we, we've been taking our time just exploring Limgrave. Fight. I guess for the time being, we maybe just attach this to it? <laughs> That's so cool! AoE flamethrower. Yeah, I'm happy with that. They straight up just give you more as well here, like, to work with. I can, I can get another, like, flamethrower shield if I want. Trines are cool for just letting you restock in supplies. gonna take a while, ain't it? I need one that goes in there. This one can fit. One. Then this one.
I love how you can just dip out of like the main game just to like, hey, solve like the little puzzle, you know? Put some wood blocks together. It's like so chill. Was there a chest? I, I did not see one. It's up there. Can I climb these blocks? Hang on, maybe. That works. Large Zanai charge. Full battery. This is another piece of heart, too. We can survive longer. The main thing for increasing survivability at this point really is just a fairy. I need to upgrade all my armor. Keep forgetting you're doing a permadeath run and how careless you're playing. <laughs> we like we like to live on the edge. This guy is awful. I can't believe he's doing this. I thank you again for your help with the balloon. Some related to geoglyph somewhere inside this, this temple. Has she tried walking into the next room? Oh no, the goddess statue fell over. This is this was the end of it before. Sundaline, sure. I was gonna restore health depleted by gloom when used in cooking. Oh, that's insane. Oh, there was a way to remove that. That we could, that fight would have been so much easier if we had that. One of the areas missing in the stone. I think so. Area's kind of spooky. I mean, there's like a pit down here. Oh, that's all the glyphs. You see it. It's in here. This is the pat down, I think. This is, this is all the, uh, the markings to look out for. This one is straight up of the Master Sword. I thought they was making a statement about our spear for a moment, the way that camera panned. You found the halberd. How about bird? Oh. They're upon the walls. Those aren't geoglyphs. What could this mean? The one we saw first was the geoglyph on the left edge of the wall. Next, Peyton. According to the floor map, it's near Rito Village. Oh, it's straight up a map of the world. Yeah. I believe my eyes behold. Who could have guessed this old ruin still had such secrets? The geoglyphs appeared all over Hyrule during the upheaval when Princess Zelda went missing. Well, they are connected to these images here. Oh. No time to dawdle. Let's hurry and investigate the remaining geoglyphs. Mm. 
Oh. Okay. Investigate geoglyphs. If more strange visions are waiting at the other geoglyphs, just like the one you already experienced, perhaps they will provide clues that could lead us to Zelda. This is so cool. There's something here, too. Tear with a tear. the Master Sword stat. Well, this one's over by Korok Forest, isn't it? That could even be an indication to just head over there. In the desert. One all the way out here. We need more space. I mean, like, my best guess for where Hestu is is probably in the forest, yeah. Maybe we do just head there next. It might be quite valuable. I don't know. Are these going to be marked on our map now? We should take a picture of this from above. Just for reference. I think that's the whole point of this room setup. Um, let's get it from just the right perspective. Yeah, I'm, I'm so curious as to what, like, this all means. Okay, got that. You know, we gotta... Gotta get one for the vine. Like, not, not even held up correctly. Get it with that glyph there in the background. What could it mean? <laughs> oh, okay, sure. Did it, you documented it, Link. That's what I was doing. The Gorons get nothing. Well, I mean, I, I think they're like etched in grass, so it's kind of like that mountain and that. There, there wouldn't really be too much to happen in, would there? Okay, do we just beeline for the Korok Forest? It's up here. I think we have to. Yeah, I, I think we really have to. Because it's just gonna be good if we can get more gear slots. Let's go for it. I, I just want to be able to carry more equipment. Let's see. Oh, what's happening? We good. Okay, let me see. Um, statue? It's down here in the basement. We need even more HP. And we gotta go to the forest, then we have to go to the Rito village. We really need to end up there today. Because we can unlock the fairy if we do that. It's going to be hard containers all the way until we get like a bar full of them. Because staying alive is key. Extra stamina does jack shit if we take a hit and die. Yeah, we don't need to ascend here because we can just... Uh, travel. There's a stable out here. 
mean, this is probably the best entry point for- I think that this is the forest area here. This one here. I, I want to be able to hold more shit. We haven't found too many Koroks, which is kind of worrying me. I only have 12 seats. Which seems like shockingly few. I'm wondering if they changed it. For like how many you need per gear slot. I'm getting Ario. I'm getting Ario. We're, we're getting to the like stable. Evan immediately forgotten them. We take a wagon if we want. Though. I don't. I don't think we'll need a wagon. Oh. 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 Sure. I'll take another reward. Oh. Oh. Take horse. Grab Ario. Korok economy has changed since the upheaval. Like it. It feels it, yeah. Close the city to Goron City. Close the stable. Sea reward. Yeah. Oh. Get the horse god fabric. Sure. Mm. For the dye shop and had no villages, new services and fabric. Oh. We have to use the Melania bed, which is said to bring prophecies from the horse guard Melania. Okay. Horse, we'll get to talk to the horse god soon. Okay, so here's the entrance. We gotta set off this direction. Signposted here, I think. This is where the ferry is up here. We gotta go past the ferry. Have we use any amiibo yet? Not yet. I I will scan them at some point. I'm always kind of wary of scanning the amiibo because they can just give you access to like end game equipment. Oh, I mean, I mean, I I already have end game equipment, but you you know what I mean. Like we don't we don't wanna just like get free shit. Like that. God, we can be okay here. Oh. I think so. Navigate the swamp. Yeah. Oh, oh. We have, we have to we have to work for our end game gear, okay? Like we put the effort in, so we we d absolutely deserve it. But I'm not gonna be like, hey, I tapped the plastic, so give me it. What happened here? Wait, wait, why is that enveloped? That's a lot more intense than it was. I see a shrine in there. Okay, the entryway is past all this here. Let's see if we can get. Okay, this is. Hey, okay, Ario! <laughs> Need to navigate. You need. You gotta work with me, bud. Okay. Okay. Hurry up. Long hair.
The question uh, Aria's not gonna die if I just leave her here, is she? <laughs> Seems to be as close as we can get. I think she'll be okay. Oh, it looks like I'm not going anywhere. Okay. I, I, I see how it is. Uh, cheeky ascend. Try to get around this. There's a bit of land here. Navigate it. I'm just wary because this is swamp. Can't go in this whatsoever. <laughs> oh, Ario, Ario, work with me. It's all right. We could, we could totally make it round. says no. Ario's, Ario's having none of it right now. We're, uh, we're almost in the clear. Ario, you gotta, you gotta work with me. You gotta work with me! <laughs> Ario! She's okay! She's okay! <laughs> it doesn't affect her! Come on, Ario! got out of it. Holy shit, Ario. What is wrong with you? We'll get Ario back. See if we can find a more direct road. Jesus Christ, that was scared me. That was so close. Like a second more and we would have been in the swamp and that would that would have been it.
Okay. We just need to go more north. Is it swap and insta kill? Yes. Yeah, if you fall in, I think it's just game over. So, um, we, we, we don't want that. Oh, you don't? You just lose a heart? Okay, alright, well... Don't want to chance it still. Don't want to chance it. It was just treacherous. Gonna follow the nice road that's now covered in goop. Oh no. Okay, that's okay, because we can just. But you, we can just leave you here. We tried, Aria. <laughs> we'll walk the rest of it. Oh my god, here's the tree. Forest is rising against us. I gotta beat one of them. They might drop something actually. Gotta wait till they burn out. Oh, they might only drop wood. I didn't even think about that. Wait, that's the lizards I need. Oh, I wasn't I wasn't nearly fast enough. Okay. Get a bit closer. That's the, that's the one I think we need. For the full heal. Okay, let's see what's happening in this forest. Like, it looks a lot worse than it was. I know there's like fog in that that's normally over it, but like this seems like to an insane degree. If something's gone wrong. Why is it corrupted? So a lot more intense than it was. I thought I heard something. No, I... I can't even approach. Even that is wrong. Um... No, that does nothing. <laughs> Just... Set the forest on fire? Can't really see what way it's blowing. Hey, you saw this before as you held a torch, but it's not even a torch here to indicate that you do it. 
immediately when I even try and enter this, it's just saying no. Light? Fire, the fire isn't doing anything. Yeah. I don't understand. Like, so, something's happened here. Korok Forest is closed. What do we do? Like, where, where, where would Hestu be? I guess we can't do it. Yeah, I, I don't know what the secret is yet to actually get inside. D don't tell me as well, by the way. Don't tell me. No one try and just spoil it and be like, this is what you do. Like, I don't. There's no need for that. I want to try and work it out. Yeah, the, the forest is just closed for business. No crop in here. Maybe there's a different entry point. Oh, this is absolutely not it. <laughs> Might be another way inside. But... I don't know. Okay, we'll go back to exploring this area for now. I don't know, like, I'm trying to think what it could be. There might be a pot from below the world? Maybe? There might be a pot from above? But, like, I, I cannot tell, like, just by looking at it. Or, like, what I need. I need to find every Korok first. <laughs> Like, literally all of them need to be in your possession. Okay, well, we can continue on our adventure to the Rito Village, at least. We should- we need to get there because we need to unlock the ferry. I- I- I can do not even caring about like the main story or anything. It's just like there is a fairy. We must get it. It's the main reason to head there. He needs defog. There's a lot of these guys. They wanted to show me the cave. These ones suck to fight. Come on. Oh, not get him. Kind of icky. Yeah, th th these guys are just kind of gross. I need I need to use up this halberd. Gotta be something in here. Traveler shield. Durability up's good, but I have I have no sp space. Hestu, where are you? 
forest has been overrun. Soldier's shield. I will take that instead of the traveler's shield. That's better. Got like the little flags again as well. Oh, I need that frog. DIY has to. And uh, use one of these ones just because the other bow is good when it's not raining, or when it is raining even. Gotta be something in here. There, there is something behind the waterfall. A quick look up here. Just trying to grab everything too. <laughs> just make your bag bigger yourself. I could like make a wagon and just like load weapons into it, but like I, I feel like that's that's not gonna work long term. <laughs> Probably have some troubles. Sticky lizard. Oh, let's try to like another little shrine here. The weapon wagon. Oh, that's actually really good. That's a really valuable find. I mean, that, that, that doesn't even have an effect on us at the moment. We probably want this instead. Climbing gear is always good, yeah. Can climb a little faster. He's not as edgy anymore. <laughs> Oh god. Keep forgetting that if I want to leave, just do it. Where the fuck am I? Ario's over here. An escape rope from Pokemon. Thinks more of a punk now. He is, yeah. I'll, I'll just take taking whatever equipment I can find. I'll upgrade it all once we get that fairy. It is, it is priority number one. There should be a tower somewhere in this area too, just to map it. Uh, there was a big guy on the bridge. We should clear him out. I remember him. Okay, wait here, Ario. Okay, there we go. Rapid fire. Yeah, it's it's served its use. We can finally use some of our other equipment. We'll never forget you, Halbert. <laughs> use this one for a while. Ario, you really need to stand back. <laughs> She's just watching. She's 
coming forward now? To, is she trying to get the loot? Yeah, yeah, you can you can take the apple. Take the apple. Oh, cool food. These are all these are all the broken weapons in that. Take a sword, maybe we can fuse it with something later. Okay. Uh, looking for a tower. I think that's the village, isn't it? Land divisions might be a little different compared to Breath of the Wild. Maybe. Some of them feel a bit different. That's the village we're looking to get, though. Uh, let's try go through... Not the canyon, okay. Ario has decided. And that's just the tower that we need. Yeah, we, we should get to that first. Be a good start, because then we can figure out the landscape better. Oh, oh. Got this table. Yeah. I can't tell if the divisions are different or not. Like they feel yeah. a bit different. I think they like adjusted some of the borders, but they're roughly the same. Oh. Maybe. Ignore that huge ravine. Yeah. Gotta get the tower. Wait, is that your man? Hestu! He's just on the road! Oh, perfect! Thank God you're here, Hestu. Trees are scaring him. Yeah, we got, we got, we gotta help, help our boy Hestu out. Set those ablaze. This is just gonna take a little while. <laughs> I just flamethrow him. Nah, uh, it, it, do it doesn't cause him to burn anymore. You have any lizards? Alakala. Scary things are gone. Please let me expand my inventory. He's already got his maracas. You see me, you see me, my name is Hestu. A musician of Korok Forest up northeast. I'm known for my maracas and my dancing. Thanks for your help. Shakash, show my appreciation. I'll do a little dance for you and make your pouch bigger. My maracas aren't working anymore. The Korok seeds inside are all gone. How has it happened again? The children of the forest must have taken them again. Had even one Korok seed, I could sing and dance and use my powers to help you. It, please give me a slot. Yeah. Weapon stash is the most important one. Yeah. He's got a new dance. He's got backup dancers. <laughs> How did you lose 900 seeds, Esther? <laughs> Yeah, it's pretty bad compared to Breath of the Wild. He's <laughs> like, oh my god. I shouldn't have left the window open. I'm in the middle of traveling, I'm thinking about heading east next. So many monsters these days that traveling is dangerous. What I like is to find somewhere I can relax. I like lively places, so maybe I'll go somewhere lots of people hang out. I have to make the weapon stash bigger. 
Love his new dance. Oh, look at the time. I've got to move on. I'll be heading east soon. Hope I can find a place where I can relax. I have enough Korok seeds to get out there and find more for me. Time we meet, let's dance together. Easter here is just the... You get his profile, that's cute. Uh, east of here is just Lookout Landon. Like, maybe? It's either there or he's gone back to the forest. Where lots of people gather. Yeah, he might be in town now. We'll have a look in a moment. We need to get this tower first. So we can have, like, a point of travel. I do want to get to some of those sky islands as well. Like, some of the layouts are insane. Is the way back up to one? Not quite the right one, though, because those are f much further away. Turn tornado is near here, too. A little worrying. Hello, horse friends. Distant relative of Mint there. Stop off here. Then so we can we can catapult ourselves into the sky once we get in. How do we get in? <laughs> hmm. Oh, that's what the block was for. Okay, hang on. Go back and get it. We're gonna need a big stick again. <laughs> We're just gonna use the block this time. Is it? Okay, see you in a bit, Ario. I mean, we could see if there's anywhere else that's nearby that we could access when we go all the way up here. You might be able to reach that one. Don't fancy my chances. Just need the tower for now. The tower might even take us higher up. the doors. Mark this. Alright, now we can catapult ourselves into the sky. We might be able to get to that structure there. We need to map the area. It's like your USB cable for your Switch. Yeah, we, we have to be able to reach something from here. If you just have more stamina, you can get to all these islands. Area is scanned. That big chunk of map here. There's the chasm. I remember that bit of it. Yeah, I think I think the board the old border I think was along that. It's changed somewhat. Here's the Sky Islands too. Quite a few here.
Like, okay, there's one just here. I mean, surely we have to try and land on it. I think I can make it. I should be out there. We're in the sky. Give me those Sunder Lions. Hey, what does this unlock? That's so cool that you can just like go up like this, yeah. It's just a sphere. There's a portal? Courage Island. My God. This just don't, just don't hit anything. Just don't hit anything and you're okay. Uh, that unlocks a shrine? It's like a new rock for you. Yeah, it does. You can still find them up here. I was fully expecting a yeah ha ha! <laughs> it's just another Korok. Hey, how's it going, bud? It's like a ceremony to test your courage. Courage is demonstrated by diving headlong through the sky. The challenge is to visit this island in a long time. I'm glad you've come. Witness your dive early. You seem to have come prepared. Let's commence with the dive ceremony. Try to test your courage. Die! I just did it. With those who succeed, receive a special outfit to mark adulthood. Okay, hang on. I'll, I'll try this again in a second if there's a, like, a round two. I just did it, so I would have thought that... You know, that was enough. Oh, hang on. I gotta get the capsules. I haven't had one of these in forever. Did you say fashion? Did you say gotcha? And put these in. Overload the machine. <laughs> Balloon? That's a, okay, sure. <laughs> Time bomb? Alright. <laughs> Sure, I'll try and use that, I guess. We got a bomb. Remote activation. I'm worried because... Actually, no, because you have to use a bow in it. Yeah, just don't accidentally hit it because then it will go off next year or something. Combat train in archery. It's another tutorial. It purifies the ancient evil. 
bombs are back. Fire your bow in midair to heighten your senses. Focus target your enemy with an arrow and release. Better attacks are ineffective here. Ready yourself. Okay. I can do it. Just kind of happy for like the the free arrows more than anything. Get a few stacks on him. And your senses take aim and defeat the enemies. This, this, this is really straightforward. There we go. Proving your mastery. There are a lot of shrines that just seem to be just hard coded as like, hey, you need to know this. Here's how you do it. Have fun. Probably gonna give me a bow, I imagine. Uh, toss out, toss away another one. I I need to go back to Hestu, cause I I can still get some more shields and bow slots. I think the bow slots are almost invaluable. We have access to so many. Use the bows. You can't fuse a bow. You can glue a bow onto something, if that's what you want. Okay, fashion is at stake. Um, so I need to complete- <laughs> To complete this guy's challenge again. I'll do it. Okay, give him a Zenai charge. I just want to see what the clothes are. Pass the pass through all the rings in 35 seconds or less. Okay. Just go fast. Huh. Go fast. Don't use the glider. Trust in the game. So that we don't just hit off something. Oh, I went too quick. Okay, so wait, so you can dive. You can dive at certain spots. That's what I need it to do. Accelerate at the, at the wrong position there. It, like, plummets you straight down. I, I can do this. It's just dangerous because I might die more than anything. <laughs> The legend of stubbed his toe guy. There we go. Very safe. Here's the mark of your maturity. You have earned this. A glide shirt. It helps you catch the air, increases the wearer's ability to glide. Aim to beat the fastest time of 20 seconds. Oh god, I I don't know if I want to keep doing it. It's it's so dangerous. I 
I have this now, though, so this might even help with completing it. I, it's basically a flight suit. That's really cool looking. Okay, let's see how much more um, mobility we have. 20 seconds or less. Most. Does it count if it's on 20? Because it has to be less. Ah. This is my last shot at it. There we go. Hey, give us something good. Records indicate that you are faster and braver than any previous challenger. I award you this in honor of your extraordinary record. You have earned it. Ah, oh, that's awful. <laughs> I don't want that as a reward. I almost died. Oh, I'm good. I wanted like the hat or something that went with like the the tunic. Okay. Well, that's that. Does anyone see any shrines? They might be hard to spot. Good. Like, there, there's a lot of territory, like, just down below. Shrines anywhere, honestly. There's a big old pit there. I feel like there's something near that. What am I doing? I was picking up something. Not quite one. It's very hard to see from here. Uh, at least we have more control. Uh, we'll check out what's happening over there. There's got to be at least one here in this area. Bunch of mushrooms in that. Mario's gone again. I'm I'm fully aware. We can get rid of these pins for now. Not gonna help us. Oh god, that was a scary challenge and not a great reward for it. Uh, unfortunately. See one up there. Friends. Can I, can I can give her to 600 bits? The game on Steam called Pineapple and Pizza. Uh, that seems really pointless. 
Why? Ah. Oh, it's handy. Yeah, but I just want it. You pants or something. That's the thing. I'm just gonna be grumpy. It's all right if I fight for the sky sequences, I guess. I'm gonna keep the climbing one on. In general, that's just more useful. Climbing and damage up. Need to get like a better headpiece if we can. One that like gives us a buff. We've got to help your man with the sign too. He's like lost to the world now. Breach of Demise. What was that one? That's the one I was at. Okay. Uh, I mean, there could be one down here. Oh, what I'd give to have a horse in this world. Boy, oh boy, that would be great. <laughs> We can check down here the West Hyrule Plain. There is a wizard. Go beat the wizard up. There you go. Topaz Rod, that seems good. Is that made with... Yeah, it's popped onto like the Zanai thing. Cool. Oh. It's a Crayola, it's what they look like, yeah. He waved at you and you shot him in the face. Like, he had to go. We needed his electricity. Maybe. Imagine you're goofing around and uh, wave at a stranger and he just guts you with an axe. He didn't actually attack me, now that I think about it. He did only wave at me. He was really just minding his own business. He probably did some kind of crime, right? Imagine daring to say hello. Now you guys want to be careful if you ever meet me in the streets of Dublin, right? You want to come up and say hi. You better think fucking twice. Help this guy out. You're free! Uh, uh. Have some oh. food. I water and wandering all throughout Hyrule collecting books. Mm. Okay. If you help, let me give you my knowledge of all things Insecta. <laughs> I've learned Hyrule too, so such wisdom will help you find all sorts of bugs in your journey. Oh. Okay. Warm and cold regions. Yeah, I mean, this, this is the kind of stuff that you already kind of know. <laughs> There's different bugs in different areas. Basically. Artie mm -hmm. pulls out a Glock at a meet and greet. You'll fucking meet me. I'll meet your end. Those unhinged meet and greet.
Gotta keep a tin can full of pennies on hand just in case you run into RT accidentally. What, what does that imply? <laughs> I'm not entirely sure I follow. Is that a weapon? <laughs> like... Distract with money to a... Game! Game, what are you doing? Game, no! Let me get the Korok. I mean, this Lionel might be possible. Oh, that's, that's an easy Korok. Some of the hoops some of the other ones make you go through. But you did it, you got the balloon. We're gonna try it. We're taking every risk. <laughs> Oh, it's so... Oh, why am I doing this to myself? Okay, speed up. I think speed is just going to be handy for covering ground against this guy. Ow! <laughs> Come on! I remember this! Okay, how, how are we gonna beat him up? Can't see because the fucking flamethrower! <laughs> Give me something that's not a flamethrower. The weakest kind, you'll be fine! <laughs> life for life!
Come on. Jesus. Permit that run continues. I'll take his May sword. Yeah, sure. Saber horn. This is some good supplies. Take a lino shield. Oh my god, we've taken every risk. Yeah, we're not- we're not doing that again! <laughs> Until we have, like, maximum armor. The second encounter with a Lionel. Like, I'm- 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 I'm not doing it. Yeah, there's a Korok here. Um, but he needs some kind of construction to reach him. Let's make like a little table. so far. Uh, fighting the final boss has been pretty the highlight of my playthrough thus far. Shrine all the way out there. It, that might be a good one to get just because like a vantage point. It's quite high up. I think we picked that one up. these fellas. I had to drink the hearty elixir too, so it's like, so, someone remember, like, it was the lizard and like a moblin horn, wasn't it? I need to remember what it was. Because we need to make more of those. Recipe book. I don't know, you don't have a recipe book, do you? I don't think you do. You can check a thing's recipe. But you don't have them stored anywhere. There's gotta be something going on here. This looks like a golf course or something. Oh my god. Oh wait, this is the Lionel bow. We should we should save that one a while. <laughs> Uh, that's pretty valuable. This does feel like some kind of golf course. Um, gotta be something here. Just a bunch of stones. There's, okay, there's a guy just chilling on this one. You got him. Wait, is there anything else?
Feels like there should be more here, doesn't there? There's an arrow. That's what the arrow is trying to indicate. This way. That's the only one. Wait, one, I think? This place is a puzzle in Breath of the Wild. Is there anything here now, though? The environment's still kind of set up. It feels like there should be, you know? It feels like there should be something here. Sometimes if I put like a boulder through a circle. It doesn't quite fit. Yeah, maybe maybe there might be something here later. I I can't figure it out at the moment. There's definitely something here. At least we got a Korok. What if I do this? No. <laughs> Good shot. Okay, we gotta get to that shrine up there. That's the next target. All these, like, ominous boxes in the sky. So much just weird stuff just hanging above us. Okay, let's get this one up the mountain. And then we'll turn around, we'll backtrack, we'll finally get to the Rito Village. I promise we're heading there. I promise that's our that's where we're trying to go. I know we went to the Korok forest and killed a Lionel and also went on this like other expedition, but that's not where we're trying to end up. <laughs> Need to reach my friend. Oh no. Oh, not another one. Where are you trying to get? He's up there. What if I just, like, attach a hot air balloon to him? <laughs> yeah, he's, I mean, we're going the same way. Go, little guy. I need you to hang on a mo. I need you to. He's, he's dead. He's gone. <laughs> How do you reset the Korok? How do you reset? Blood Moon, he might reset. Okay. Maybe if I go in and out of an area, too. I'm gonna pillage this little garden that's here, too. Okay, well, the shrine is, you know, just a little bit further up, so. It's headed in the right direction. You leave and come back, the puzzles usually reset. Okay. Check in a moment. Climbing gear is helping us here. It's 
pick up another one. It's like apple woods here. This could be the forest where we spell fuck. But I don't actually have like a just a low quality axe right now. I don't I don't want to use my tools. We're gonna hang out. Missing pathways. Uh, I mean, this is a quick... No. Determined to not use Ascend. get up there. Need some. There we go. Can I climb this one? Oh, but I can just make a new place to ascend. That's how you're supposed to solve that one. Uh, here, pop this here, and then you uh, I keep going to fuse. Don't use the send. Just don't do it. Pop this here? Just pop it there and just ascend. That's pretty much it. Go up here first. He gives a lot of arrows in comparison to the Breath of the Wild. Yeah, but like you're using the arrows to do so much more stuff in this game, you know? Like you you really need them. The light stuff up, put stuff on fire. Even to use bombs, like you, you, you need to have arrows. I think I prefer this game system, though. It, it feels like so much more evolved. Like, there's way more possibilities with everything. There's a bit of sim more simplicity with Breath of the Wild. It's like here's the fire arrow. You know, but you can basically get that here. It's raining again. It, the, these woods are just cross. <laughs> uh oh. You heard me. No, we'll just leave him be a I'm gonna see if the Korok guy is alive and well. He's back! Okay. So I I mean I I I just want to see what happens. Yeah, he's showing you where his friend is. Okay. 
we need to get him into position. It's not a good angle for the rocket. Hang on. Keeps falling over. Okay, what if I glue him to one of these as a scaffold and it just goes with him? Okay. Korok space program. He's soon to be on. He's screaming. He, he knows what's about that. No! I need to get the angle right. It needs to be facing that way a bit. Okay, get ready, bucko! <laughs> he made it! He made it! See where he landed. <laughs> oh god! Oh thank god he got wedged behind the tree. <laughs> okay, here is your friend delivered. The space program was a success. That went shockingly well. <laughs> what if someone made like a wagon, right? And they went across Hyrule and gathered all of these Koroks, put them all in the wagon, and then like built like a, a spacecraft to just launch them all. Cause there, there's like quite a few Koroks out there. It would take a lot of work. Oh, all the plants came back too. Neat. There's even more of them. Get all clean. Okay, happy days. Ferb, I know what we're gonna do today. We're gonna send a Korok to the moon. There is one that's like a planet shape. Can't see it now, obviously, because of the thunderstorm. There was one that's just like a round circle. Or sphere. I wouldn't mind getting a Korok to the moon. I kind of want to see what happens. Or if it's possible. Don't forget to get your rocket back. I think the rocket burns out. I didn't see it. There's another one. Yeah, strap ten rockets to a single Korok and just go. See where he ends up. We're marking a few new spots. There's absolutely something at the bottom of the canyon here, too, isn't there? The game is so massive. I, I feel like I'm gonna be playing it, like, for years. Just, like, searching and uncovering stuff. And I'm waiting for the rain to pass so I can get back up. That shield metallic? No, it's not, actually. Thanks for the gift sub. 
We're going low before he got too far. Well, no, you have to make sure you go on the rocket, too, just to make sure the Kor Koroks make it. Get, like, every single one of them that's dotted about the world. Gather all the Koroks. And just send them to the, to the moon. It'd be amazing. A Korokit, if you will. <laughs> Yeah, we're waiting for the rain. It's how the blood moon was invented. <laughs> it just like, it just collide with it and it's like, oh my god, there's blood everywhere. Oh, I'm having so much fun. Okay, we'll wait for the rain to pass and we'll get going again. I've, but has he felt spelt fuck yet? No, I haven't. It it will happen. It will get there. That tree, that, that forest became sentient and was fighting back. Not Orish. Still by a cliffside waiting for the rain to end up having so much fun. I'm having the best times. So I'm stranded on this cliffside. The climbing gear go. Gotta be another one over there somewhere. Make our way back. Let us gamble, Dad? What what are you asking the gamble about? <laughs> Please. I've had finances for so long. Where do you die? <laughs> Listen, you're gonna lose a lot of mo like a lot of your channel points if you start betting on that, because I'm not going to die. Wait, I forgot to have a sword equipped. I'm not going to die. Not happen. Oh god, there's a battle station! I'd like a really choppy FPS because he's in the distance. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna go board him. Commandeer in your vessel. There we go. Give us some loot, please. And then, I guess we just stick this onto this. Yeah. Gotta put it on something. <laughs> it's just that easy. <laughs> Taking no prisoners. We've already fought off a of Lionel, right? <laughs> I think we have a good shot of doing this. Where's Ario? I... I don't fucking know anymore. Huck. 
Ario's just off and doing her best. Oh, we gotta help your man with the sign again. Hang on. Give me a second. I can get this right. <laughs> this, this looks structurally sound. <laughs> I was facing the wrong way. That's 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 the problem. Mm. <laughs> Hang on. Okay, we 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 just we just need more glue. Hang on. And I've got another idea. But this here. This here. I know we slot the mechanism in place. Perfect. It's actually not a bad little mecha- like, like, setup for it there. It's not the worst. Compared to, like, the blob piles I've constructed. <laughs> Give us your dinner. Give us another bomb, oh. too. It's not the worst. Okay, there's another shrine over here. Make our way. There's like a base camp up there too. Make our way to the shrine. Not the worst, but it's also disappointing. <laughs> Look, it worked, didn't it? Oh, I kind of want whatever he's got. That's a big weapon. Hang on. I'm just going to waltz up to the fort. You didn't see nothing. Uh, let me just... <laughs> there we go! Yeah, I need to drop something for this. days. Opal. Sorry to mention this, but it's killing me inside. Why the hell does the big finger of the hand power in the top left of three notes and not two? What do, what, what do you... Oh, three knuckles, do you mean? Oh, it's just the hands. The different guy. <laughs> You're asking me that as if I'm like personally responsible for this too.
It's like, why have you done this? I mean, this is dangerous, but I think the coast is... I thought you were dead. Okay, we're all right. Base camp is taken care of. Why did you give him three knuckles? We must know. You see, I made this game, so you know, I should know. This is my creation. First person streaming it. Obviously responsible for the UI and design of this Nintendo game that took actual years to make. It's true. Why do you think I was in Japan? That's right. Made the Ascend mechanic just for himself not to use it. Up on top of this. Uh, I think there's a Korok here. Oh, just how many Koroks are there? Oh, it's my favorite game mechanic. <laughs> I'm not gonna be able to do it. Because of the rain. moment. <laughs> Evening, dreads. Yeah, let me, let me, I'll just, uh, just nip away from you real quick. Oh! That's, that's not what I expected, right? Oh, okay, so there's like a window here so you can like figure that out. Secret treasure room, yeah. It's scripted. <laughs> Don't like the size of the hammer he's got. Okay, all right, this is, this is a bad setup. This place is treacherous. Still alive. Did he just throw his friend at me? He's dead. He's dead. <laughs> he didn't survive. He just got back to sleep now after he like picking up his friend and murdering him.
Wow, that was incredibly close. Thank God we're all right. Spiky shield. I, I just don't want it. <laughs> just no. I'm not... <laughs> Let's, let's not, let's not do that. Okay, there's another Korok who's fallen and can't get up. There's yet another shrine over there as well. Getting quite a few mapped. Must be the one for the stable, it's quite high up. See where this Korok bud needs to get to. He's he's just a long way down the road. Let's go. Let's go. Give him a piggyback ride. Oh, actually, wait. We could. There's a wagon here. It's just, it's just gloomed there. I, 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 should I park this? <laughs> Let's just leave him there. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Ooh. Okay. Got another oh. stamp. Oh. Take Ario. Oh. Catch a harness. Oh. Oh. Mm. Oh. Okay. Take precautions against the cold. There has always been a, a, a chilly region, but ever since the recent extreme cold snap, they don't even have enough to eat. You see a Rito visitor here named uh, Badoli. She's come from Rito Village to stock up on food. Oh no. Okay. Yeah, here they are. They got her in food supplies. This is a blizzard. Fortunate the kind folks from the stable are sharing the supplies with us. <laughs> it's them that the children still have full bellies. Oh. Mention it really, the Rito have been good neighbors to us. We just returned the favor. Oh. Okay, we'll have to have to head up there soon anyway. Oh. Let me take all these supplies they just brought. I'll put them to better use. Get Ario in position. We're actually doing this. Wait. Hang on, Ario. Sir? We can actually transport the Korok. Let's go! We're hit we're hitting the road. We can take whatever supplies we want now. We can put like a cooking pot in this and like make like a mobile base. Okay, hang on, bud. Lucky we got Ario and like like Ario's stats are actually pretty. <laughs> just hang in there, buddy. <laughs> just hang in there. Yeah, they they got here okay. 
That's, that's not how the wagon should be pulled. Here we go. Yeah, that that's really cool that you can just do this. Red Dead Redemption now, <laughs> basically. Because hey, there's like one bit of Twilight Princess where like, I think you're you're guiding a car. I don't think you're pulling it, but you're guiding one. That was a cool little sequence. Now you can just do that whenever. You can just load this with weapons too if you want. Obviously, you have to be a bit more careful with the roads you select if you're doing this. Like, you, you shouldn't be bringing it up here, probably. It does slow you down, yeah. I mean, it's still cool. No, 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 all right, oh, Jesus Christ. You're actually gonna be the death of me. Oh, Jesus. God damn it, Ario. Oh, God. Like, she was about to go for that. Oh, Jesus. He was about to go. Combat train and archery after all this time. Sure. Why not? It's just different tutorial. I'm surprised how many tutorial shrines there are. I don't think I still need them. Like, this is just telling me, yeah, headshot. Like, you, you know, you can work that out. You don't, you don't really need this. I think if you got this far in the game, like, you know, you'd know this. And they just bundle all into a combat shrine. Yeah, they could have. I mean, hey, we get some free upgrades from this. So it's still something. It's worth doing. There we go. Good job, you shot someone. You know, headshots do more damage in game. Yeah, because I feel like that's such an inherent thing. You have to be someone who's like never played a video game to kind of know it, you know? It's been around so long. I think you'd even work that out from playing this by just occasionally shooting someone in the head. Uh, we'll leave that treasure here. Okay, almost another piece of heart. Jacob Miguel had a good head video in headshots and games. I've seen that, yeah. Not even games that think John Wick takes the, the top spot for just the most amount of like brutal killings. It's the immediate What happened to my wife? Ario! Ario, it was right here! Where did it go? Where did it go? It didn't fall off the cliff, did it? Someone stole my wagon.
Zero, thank you for a thousand bits. <sighs> Despawns. That, that makes me very sad, yeah, that you can't keep vehicles. Hey, is there a stone nearby? Oh, it's right here. A nice Venn diagram. I hope they change that. Yeah, that'd be cool. They did. For some reason, I feel like there's gonna be a DLC that just straight up gives you an airship at some point. Yeah, we can see what's at the top of this mountain. And then we can get to the other shrines. There's one more shrine on this half. There's probably like another like two or three even tucked away here. There's like so many shrines. Hover bike DLC. Oh, he's got a signpost again. Hang on. What's he even doing up here? Here, let's, uh... Start sellotaping some boulders together. Keeping it, keeping it nice and secure for you. and go. President Hudson will rule the world. Like, why does he even need a sign at the top of this mountain? There's, there's not even a road here. I'm gonna go to, like, the sky and I'm gonna see this guy, like, up there on, like, the moon. Oh, there's the village. We're almost there. Got a puff ah. room this time. There's a whole other island area as well. That's like, there's like a ravine that way too. I think that's over it. My god, there's like a way up from the top of the mountain. Maybe. I the tower perspective. Okay, let's uh right down here a bit. Oh, that's a Korok. No? You must have to dive specifically from the top. Or, like throw a stone into it or something, yeah. Buddy. Have to dive. Okay, here, I'll, I'll try it again. Thought if you just jump in, it's like generally okay. No, we didn't forget Ario this time. Like, we, we, we can't bring Ario over the mountain. He's gonna go look for the wagon. See you later. There we go. Score to zero because of poor entry splash. Koroks have very high standards. Take their guts. Oh no, we could just like fasten these to a Korok and like send them to the moon. <laughs> that way works too. Jam is leaking into our world again here. 
Hop down that in a moat. We got another shrine first. The below ground areas really scare the shit out of me. Just because like, you you really can't see. But there's something at, like so good down there. There has to be. I feel like I need to get more kit though before I can properly go through them. It's just way too dangerous right now. It's like you can't even really run when you're down there. You run out of space a lot. Built to carry. What we doing, gang? We need to get some kind of ball. Just recall all this? Uh, I can go... Over here? Have a look. I can see Sonic Rails. For some reason. <laughs> gotta make like a. Okay, we just gotta transport the marble, I think. here there's a lot of poles here I'm wondering what I need the poles for oh I th I think I see because that's a small one this is a wide one okay I see what you gotta do here okay hang on For another long stick. Except this time we're gonna make it a lollipop. Okay. Pop it on. Okay, and... Oh, neat, they give you some more construction materials so that you can make the stick even longer. guys I see the treasure chest too I have an idea okay okay hang on hang on hang on okay just be careful there be careful there bye bye Pop that down there. Can I just 
fasten this. Fasten this here. I can't quite reach the ladder. Alright, hang on. We'll find a way to make this work. Because I used the wrong end, of course. Almost got it. The sneaky stairs. <laughs> okay. I don't know what's wrong with it. I it's not structurally sound. Hang on. What if I walk on this beam? Can't walk on the beam. I can climb on it though. <laughs> oh, I might be able to live without the opal here. I might be able to live without the opal. I don't think I can make that one. <laughs> hey, there we go. Exactly as the developers intended. Oh, I don't want that. Okay. Uh, let's solve. Let's solve the, like, the actual bit of the puzzle now. Hang on. Okay, so this this actually might not work the way I want. Hang on. <laughs> yeah, the, the game is satisfied. I'm kind of worried there's a bit of weight. <laughs> so what I'm going to do is I'm going to take it back. And I'm, I'm just going to make it a little longer. Surely, surely this is long enough. <laughs> Turned it a bit too much, I got. Oh, perfect. That will wedge it. I, I just gotta go quick. I gotta go quick. Damn it. <laughs> oh, we had the solution.
We had the solution, okay. Thankfully, they put the ball back over there. It wasn't long enough, yep. Bug report! Mr. Miyamoto, I, I'm so sorry. I have to let you know. The game, the game is just not up to a high enough standard. Get some bits of the long stick. But I, I know it's back over there. I'm just getting this bit too. If I can. This is gonna be quite tricky to get this bit across. Wait! Actually, I, I have an idea. Hang on. Safely transported. Uh, now we just need to extend the stick out. That was absolutely the problem. It wasn't long enough. Bits and bobs we can just attach. <laughs> Nintendo is such a creative company. Every piece of the puzzle crafted to fit one minor purpose that's less effective than making a really long stick. <laughs> The developers are probably like gonna be crying when they see that like this is how some people are interacting. <laughs> oh no. Okay, up we go. Yeah, we just need to position it. Just send it across. And the nice thing is we build a handy little... Oh, I didn't get to make the jump. Just hoping to walk across. I, wait, hang on. Can I? Straighten it out. I don't think, I don't, I think it's touching the ceiling. I want to see if I could, like, just get it. <laughs> Another puzzle solved. Someone has to do a tally on the amount of shrines that could just be solved with a long stick. Because <laughs> I think it's like at least half of them.
Oh my god, it's so stupid. Okay, another dungeon clear. Um, we had... There's one marked over there. There's the portal into hell here. Go check that out real quick. Gam's gotten loose on the world again. I'm more so worried if I jump down this, I'm just gonna like hit a branch or something that's just extended and it's like instantly die. Especially when you get to the part where you can't even bloody see. doing down here Aww. uh here you go have a seed mm. uh. really saved me it's so dark around here you can't see a thing without the little glow oh i'm seeing the ground to hit it as hit it is all right experts explorers attach them to arrows and fire them mm -hmm. huh. wait wait what Oh, you guys are back! <laughs> Flamethrower. <laughs> oh, thanks for the top tip! Yeah. I think they had a sword, but I think it just rolled off the mountain. So, it's, it's probably gone now. They have a hot air balloon here for getting back out. That's very cute. A lot of life's problems can be solved with a long stick or a flamethrower. It's true. It's one of those two is the solution. Long flamethrower. Even better. I can see a little bit here now, too. Still no idea, like, what I'm looking for here. This area kind of just exists. See posts, I can. I, there's more statues. It has its own mountains. Okay. Top on back, because I think Hestu might actually be in the town. He said he was going somewhere where there's people. To the east. We also have a point of heart to get. For my maximum immersion, I need you to pronounce every light root and shrine name. Please and thank you. <laughs> yeah, sure thing. You know, I haven't pronounced anything wrong um, for at least 10 minutes. Hey, where uh where did, would Hestu be? Can't even be down here. Get, get our emergency praying. He was just right up above, was he? Cool. Still needs- this is- again, we're just trying to unlock the fairy, you know, it's been a priority for the last five hours of gameplay. <laughs> trying not to get sidetracked. 
There's so much to do. Okay, where are you, Hestu? There he is. Oh, please don't move again. Just, just live here. He must dance. It's built recently, huh? It's got a good vibe, and I figure it's safe since there are lots of people there. I'm gonna relax here a while. So I think it's like it's gonna just be one again to get a shield and an extra bow slot. Let's just get that done. And yes, we have to watch him dance every time. Shield stash. I love that he has a little entourage now. <laughs> Dance is crucial for the plot, it's true. It's very important. Okay, uh, I'm gonna get... Yeah, get an extra bow. We're using the bow so much. Guy's child support must be crazy. I don't think the Koroks are his kids. At least I hope not. Okay, uh, three for a new weapon. New weapon slots are always so valuable. I'm gonna get another bow as well. Yeah, I'm investing in bows quite a bit here. I don't think I need to do shields as much. You can skip with X? No, absolutely not. How dare you? Okay, you'll need five for that. You'll need five for that. And he'll need two for a shield, so I should probably just get a shield and five. Yeah, okay. We're going to watch it every single time. I'm glad he's relocated here too. He, I, he doesn't seem to want to move again, which is great. Just live here forever, Hestu. It's so much easier for us. Okay, happy days. Look at the amount of space we have now. So much more room. Happy the help. I, I I also need to buy like a lot of arrows. My beetle was it was charging more. You bastard beetle. He was charging like five for thirty. He got scammed. Yeah, I thought I thought he was giving me a good rate. Okay. Is there any other like side missions to unlock? Like, does Pura have anything for us? He's just existing. Hmm. Any visible injury? So you must be holding up. Okay. Oh yeah, just check out the regions. There's another village that might yield more answers. So I'm directing an investigation to what's going on there. Mm -hmm. Hakariko village, home of the Shika tribe, off the southeast in the Nakluda region. My ruins, each shaped like a ring, fell directly on top of the village. Hmm. Oh! Okay, so something's happened there, too. If the atmosphere in the shelter, you could probably point you in the right direction. 
He helps deploy the Monster Control Crew Squads, where they're needed and has extensive geographical knowledge. Tell me more about the various regions of peoples. Hmm. Check it. Okay. I'm glad we ran into Hestu when we did. Like, I feel like we could have just missed him outright. Hey, is it this guy? Oh. This is Wartsworth. Hmm? He's investigating Hylian. Hmm. There's nothing to show us. Get the I get the Kakariko, basically. Mm -hmm. I stand top of the news in each mm -hmm. region. Yeah, so th these guys are all just directing you. It's like, hey, get cold and resist. Go here. Shrines are everywhere. Where's your Where's your man that we have to talk to? Anson. Looking for a hidden passageway. This guy with the map. Might be this Ooh. guy. There we go. The complicated factor if you get lost during your travels, please make sure to say, check your destination. Oh. Quite confident in my knowledge of Hyrule's peoples and places. Ah, uh, so he'll tell you all about like the areas oh. and that. Okay. Sheikah are renowned for their wisdom. In fact, the most prolific researchers are among them. You do have lookout landed Purus from the Sheikah tribe. Uh, and yeah, he's just monster control crew. Increasing the number of unfamiliar monsters. It's kind of American points of interest. Snail Gamer, thank you for the thousand bits. Thank you very much. Yeah, the last stream was insane. Today's been a bit calmer. It's been a bit calmer, although we did almost die like twice. Fishy, thank you for a thousand bits as well. Have a good one. Hope you enjoy playing the game. Okay. Um, we can head back to the stable. We can get across this bridge. I uh, we're going to the Rito Village. And these two shrines. We're going to. <laughs> Keep getting distracted. I should probably do some cooking too, because we we actually burnt through a lot of food in the last fights. Oh, are you still here? We'll get him back once we get down here. What is something here? Korok friend. Down here. That's enough for... I think another shield upgrade. Go! Cool. Four hours later. This is look, there's just so much to do. Like we might have an objective. But, like you have to get distracted in a game like this. It's 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 the true way to play it. It really is. Okay, we're gonna make just a stamina heavy meal. Uh, everyone was telling us that, hey, it's cold, so we probably want to make something with just, like, yep, ju just spice. Full resistance of 12 minutes. These will keep us alive for a long time. This will increase your strength, so let's just go all out. Making strong foods today. A mighty mushroom skewer.
Hey, RT. Did you know if you follow the main story of the game, you'll end up beating it? I actually don't know if that's true. <laughs> what was it? Was it this and... Was it this lizard? It was like a bacoblin horn. That's a hasty elixir. Not quite right. How much food can I actually carry as well? It was a blue lizard. Okay. Blue lizard required. Okay. Uh, what other foods should I make that might be important? What are we thinking, gang? Can do like this. Coconut and mushrooms. Fruit and mushroom mix. Ellie, thank you for the 500 bits. Thank you very much. Excited for Eurovision later. Uh, I could just do steak and banana. Mighty meat skewer. So much food in a person now. But we, we, we need to. We, we need to just have as much equipment as possible. Muddle bud? Confuses people. I don't know if I want to cook with these. Cook in the dish give a glowing effect to anyone who eats it. Try this. You glow for 10 minutes. That could be really good for exploring underground. Just eat a glow stick. Brainy, thank you for a thousand bits. Thank you very much. Hope you're enjoying the content. Does it sound safe to eat? That sounds amazing. What are you talking about? Like, it's glow sticks. We don't need to, like, slow our pace with, like, the buds anymore. We can just run. Okay, uh, stealthy dish. We haven't had the need for stealth yet, but we can try it. Sneaky mushroom skewer. It sneaks up on you. The ice fruit might be good, uh, considering that we're entering a cold climate soon. Cold weather attack, four minutes. Its petals can restore health depleted by gloom when used in cooking. I'm doing, I'm doing one of these. Okay, so you don't, you know, I don't need to do use that many. All right, <laughs> that's good to know. Yeah, th th this restores broken hearts. That's so valuable. Uh, carrot meal. Speed. You can get a gloom resist effect off of these. Oh, no, that did not work. Okay, well, there goes all that material. Isn't that a glow fish? Okay, this offers resistance to flames. I'm gonna use one of them and I'm gonna use like a high value monster part. Like some, something quite good. Horrible in horn. Flame guard, yep, yeah, that's that's good. And we'll go one more elixir like that. 
We're preparing for like every possible scenario. We've so much cooking on our person now. <laughs> We're just trying to see everything we can get. Look at it to increase your stealth. Sneaky greens. Raises defense. Yeah, I, I think there's enough here to, to work with for the time being. The main one we have is a bunch of cold resist. Hope you guys like just a pile of peppers. We have so many peppers. Gotta imagine how bad that backpack must smell. It's just like everything is just like being tossed around. One more point, okay. Come on, Ario! Oh, she's running. We'll have to see, we'll have to see if she can get back down. I think she's stuck. Uh, she, she's covered. That's it's a bit of a dangerous path. She made it. <laughs> Just the saddle. <laughs> hey, Ario, it's good to see you. Yeah, we need, we need, we need to remove that. Ooh. The harness, even. Actually listens there. We have cold resist gear. We are equipped for the elements. Let's finally get to the village. I'll just try and make it. That street coming down from the sky. I've already missed the bridge. Already going the wrong way. Doesn't Aryo need the resistance potions too? Nah, she'll be fine. I think there is a shrine like below this. There wasn't the base game, there's like a whole area down there. There's shrines fucking everywhere. Find them forever. All good in chat there, hang on. Oreo is too powerful for the cold. Oh. Oh, oh. Send help dad. Ah well thank you for 500 bits. Did you enjoy your pizza last night? I didn't actually get pizza last night. I was too tired to order pizza. I know that sounds weird, I just... Mentally, I was just like, I just want to perish. <laughs> I was exhausted last night. I'm gonna. I was gonna order pizza later tonight, though. After I end the stream, that is the plan. Toned it down a bit. Glad he takes watcher feedback into account. Are people upset about me swearing again? 
Do you want me to say fuck ten times in a row? Hang on. <laughs> I, mean, we, I made the joke like so many times where it's like, this is child fucking friendly, you know, like, <laughs> on this channel. Oh no. Oh, hey, where's this guy going? Oh, uh, Head the to Rito Village, which is uh, suffered through a fierce blizzard. Just cheer him up with music and supplies. Got my wagon going a pretty good clip on the road, but then I suddenly drove into this hole. This is a pretty bad pothole. <laughs> this is... This is pretty rough. Okay, the only thing I have left is the wagon. Oh. I figured I had to get both me and my wagon out of this hole and I won't leave it behind. Oh. I believe that you've come to rescue me, but I hope you have a plan to free me from this hole. The Hornist! <laughs> I'm sure- I'm sure that's the, like, position title, but it just doesn't sound right. <laughs> I'm sure that is the exact term you use. Okay, so wait, I so I just need to get like his the Hornist's dramatic escape. He wants to get out, but not without his wagon. Is there some way to help? Um. Okay, wait. I think I've got the solution. Oh, hang on. It solves every puzzle. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, no, that's what you wanted. That's what you wanted. Oh. He wants him as well. How do, how do I get him in the wagon? Buddy, I, I, look, it's, it's assembled. I can't put him on it. Get in the wagon! <laughs> Get in the wagon! Oi! Okay, hang on, buddy, right? <laughs> you did it, but. He's safe now. <laughs> it works every time. Uh. I didn't come along. I don't know how much longer I would have been stuck in that hole. To think if I hadn't made such a rash decision in the earliest days of the upheaval and run off with my troop, these things wouldn't have ended up like this. I mean, the supplies I collected to help feed Rito Village have all spoiled by now anyway. Oh. I get back to the stable trotters and rejoin my bandmates. Oh, so, okay, he's gonna be... He's back at the gang. Oh. We still need to find a violin, though. Here's some bee honey. Stamina recovery effect. Yeah. Yeah. 
That's pretty good. There's like more fans than that there if we want to kill for anything. I don't think there's anything I need to... I'll make another flamethrower. I have so many flamethrowers. Stop making flamethrowers. <laughs> I need something. I need something else. I could take a Zonite. Ah, oh, but I could make a flamethrower. Flamethrower. Okay, all right. Well, just one flamethrower. <laughs> Look, I can dual wield them now. Perfect. Desperately need to get more of the, um... The battery power. Can I... Surely I have, like, enough of a currency to get some more of this. I have 50 crystallized charge. I think that was one of them that I needed. A hundred of these. I- I literally need one. No, it's a hundred of the charge. Oh, okay. Okay, well, we're getting there. And Ario, come on over. I wonder what effect the other band members are gonna have on the fairy, if any. Cause, like, she was only requesting a violin. That we need to get to the Rito village. And follow this road all the way up. Lionel under the castle drops 50. Um, I, I can't beat that Lionel. We beat a basic level Lionel today and it almost killed us. Was it, was it a basic level? That was like a black Lionel, wasn't it? I don't know if that's basic or not. It was like a blue one or something that's weaker. That was a red Lionel, okay. That was basic then. Just do it. My god, I hadn't considered that. Okay, we can take out their little camp here. Time to test the flamethrowers. <laughs> Flamethrower strat. <laughs> I don't even need to touch him. They're all dead. That was an explosive for a moment. Let's keep going. Only you could start wildfires. God. 
Oh, wait, he's here. He's got a different kind of sign. Hang on. I'm gonna have to think real outside the box to solve this one. The new banner. Hello? Oh, I think he was scared. Yeah, there you go, he's upright. He's standing strong. What if I just immediately just yank it? Take this with my thanks. <laughs> More food. Another bomb. Why does he have so many bombs on him? Okay, I don't. Ario? You gotta work with me, bud, right? No, not today. Okay. We're good. I'm not fusing the bomb with my I'm not fusing the bomb with anything. <laughs> He's gotta stop asking that one. It just seems like a bad idea. Okay. Starting to get a bit chilly. Uh, what we can actually do is we actually have just a pair of pants we can pop on for the time being. Don't need to use more than that. It's only if it gets even colder we need to, like, go all out. God, it was so green in Breath of the Wild when you were here. It's crazy seeing it all, like, expand it like this. In the shortcuts by Hylian Pinecone mishap taught me that. Gotta do the work and chop down the trees. Uh, uh. No, it's not. It's the Lucky Clover Gazette. I'm sorry, old habits die hard. Oh, this is... This is where they're operating the newspaper, is it? He's like your mailman. Basically, our editor here is getting ready for our big Princess Zelda investigation. You hear about our newspaper, right? And you can talk to me too, I'm next in charge. I say you did a good job finding us out here. Some go right on by. Pretty unusual for a newspaper to be run out of a stable. Gracie cheated the previous owner out of this place. Oh, it's no longer a stable. Right. Ah. They've full on just taken it. I don't know where we're Tracy for you. Uh, uh? Hey, listen, Pat. I told you I was busy, but you keep bothering me. I think I bought this place from the owner after we came to a fair, mutually beneficial agreement. You stopped telling people I cheated him out of it. <laughs> hmm? It's a scam. Uh? Okay. You give me and this guy a second here. I got- I- I need to re- I'm here to reinstate a violinist. That's it. That's my own- that's the only reason I came. Ah. Yeah, I- I know Zelda's missing, and like, you should probably report on that in the paper, but I really just need to get the band back together. I need better armor. Ah. Yeah, interest. That's why she asked you to investigate places seriously impacted by the upheaval. Ah. Okay, we're getting tips from all over Hyrule, so many, in fact, that it's been hard to keep up. 
among those tips we've been hearing about someone who looks like the princess appearing in all sorts of places. Ah. Got to assign Pen to chase those leads, but he could use a partner. Don't tell Pen who you are. It's better if no one knows you're involved. Uh, sure. You're gonna pay me money too. <laughs> a full set of froggy armor? Down, it's easy to cling to wet surfaces, no sli- Oh my- This is the best game ever made now. This is the best game ever made. They- they actually fixed it. <laughs> this is the best game. This is the only thing I wanted, and they did it. Ma. Give you this arrow piece by piece, I have to get it. Hey. I have to get it. Our editor here says you're in and looks like I had you sized up right. Tracy knows how to pick them. Ah. You too. Here's what you're going to do. Visit every stable for leads. Oh, this is going to take a long time. <laughs> Once you and Penn to dig up whatever newsy details you can by visiting stables. That's going to take so long. Ah. Work with Penn to get to the bottom of the rumors about Princess Zelda. I give you Froggy Arrow piece by piece. We we have to do it. That's so worth it. Wait, can I get the violin going again? What, what was what do I need to do at the stable? Ma. Ma. Canvas the stables and see what you can find out. Forget the rest of the game. It's Froggy Armor time. On a trail of the truth about Princess Zelda, and let even the smallest clue slip through our talents, or hands in your case. Visit as many stables as we can, travelers always have plenty of going on to talk about. Soar along. I need the froggy armor. I, I'm gonna see if I can go to some of the existing stables I've already been to. And just see if there's anything I can pick up. I need- I will get to the Rito Village. I need the froggy armor though. I have to get it. Fuck, I didn't even get the shrine there. <laughs> no. Hang on, wait, 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 uh, the auto save. Thank God. Let's just teleport back real quick. Save us a bit of a walk. He's cheating. <laughs> I just I need the froggy armor. Hey, okay, where where's the shrine? I'm guessing that's the one up the hill. I have to have it because like, like the amount of times it just starts raining and it's like well guess I can't play the game <laughs> for like 10 minutes. I, I need to get it. It's so important. God, I'm not even joking. Oh it's just the blood moon it's fine. Don't mind the blood moon so much as I do mind just when it rains. Uh, can I just set it on fire? <laughs> that just work? Yeah, there we go.
I have a flames. I have two flamethrowers equipped. I have two flamethrowers in my hands. And I'm like, well, better, like, get the fire arrow ready. Brain is absent. Oh, they're giving you free rockets in this. Okay, hang on. I ignore the shrine puzzle. Uh, just ro rocket get. How does this work? Oh, oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my! Jesus! <laughs> okay, alright. This is the rocket shield. Go don't fucking pull this one out accidentally. Because we'll be in trouble. It is a utility purpose. Do not use it by accident. I'm gonna destroy just the flashlight on this. I wanna see what this does. That just fights with the rocket, I think. Rocket spear. It's not gonna explode in my face, is it? That goes really far. Is that what I'm supposed to do here? The only thing the game has given me is rockets. I think I just need to... Yeah, we just we just need to instigate like a launch. Okay, but they they exhaust your ability, unfortunately. Spear's already gone. Okay, so just keep the rocket shield in reserves. All right. I'm guessing we need to fasten rockets to things now. Unless, can we make a long stick? No, there's, there's just simply not enough materials this time. There's not enough materials. Long rocket. The, the thing is now, though, we know that this shrine is here. If we ever just need rockets for whatever reason. Like, we just have them. <laughs> okay, don't put it on the side. Gotta be, gotta be careful. <laughs> Is this even gonna work, like, position-wise? But God, I hope I don't just die against the wall. This is so dangerous. Okay, what if we just like fasten the rocket here? This is 
so dangerous. Get me out! <laughs> Almighty. I'm not I'm not messing around with the rockets longer than this. Like I'm I'm going to die. I'm going to get myself killed in a rocket accident. Just pick it up and go. I feel like every shrine we be we like stupidly solve it or like come within an inch of our life or like something bad happens. Tonight on Top Gear. That's exactly the, the like the energy it has. Yeah. Okay, I need to get back to collecting frogs. Frog armor. No, I I need to do fucking Rito Village. <laughs> I need to do Rito Village. I can't keep ignoring it. Okay, I'm gonna check the stables I've been to. See if there's anything to do with the frog armor. And then do Rito Village. Very quickly. I'm not gonna go- I'm not- I'm not adventuring around the entire continent of Hyrule looking for the frog armor. Just yet. Okay, I need- I need to go to the Rito Village. Okay. Are we looking for your man here, or this guy's with the newspaper? Great fairy has fled. Love to go learn from wordsmiths at the Lucky Clover Gazette when Hebra's big cold snap passes. What exactly are we looking for? Here's your man. Hmm. Hey, a trace of the recipe remains, just a remnant of half-eaten Hylian pine cones. Oh. Apparently, you're looking good. Were you also pulled to this place by the inescapable tug of a story? New chirps and warbles for my beloved little birds. The stable has been raised in a small herd of white goats, until they all vanish mm. all of a sudden. Why don't you talk with Chork? Oh. Uh. His goats ran away. The Hylian pine cone ingredient. A recipe. Okay, where where have they gone? I really hate Princess Zelda's recipe. Okay, so I I'm guessing. There's a trail here. It's just pine cones littered around the world now. The question is how far did they go? Came off the road here. Gonna pick up a lot of pine cones for this too. We're gonna just be like a monster or something that just wanted to eat them all. And like knew that they liked it. Well, that's the wrong one. Cone trail. I need to go to Rito Village. This is helping us. This is for the frog armor, okay? Here they are. You 
found the goat. I could have killed the goats from meat there. As well as using the Keep Princess Zelda's recipe safe. To check. Grind the pine cones into a powder. I'm not supposed to use the Hylian pine cone whole. Should have known something was off. It did look really hard to eat. <laughs> oh, the goats hated it this entire time. These poor goats. Get the, we get the recipe now. Hey, what were you thinking, man? Just like, it's like so crunchy. Ow! Oh! Oh god. Maybe the white goats set up to find the bottle themselves because they couldn't stand to eat the wrong recipe anymore. <laughs> I I somehow doubt it. Apparently you did well to get such results your first time out while well, I'm feeling a little proud of myself. It's a start to an old nest egg. Yuck. Take up more stories, your base rate will obviously increase, and there are bonuses of course. I'm gonna hurry back to HQ and bring word of this story's conclusion to our readers. Sapa! So long. Wait, how how many missions must I complete to give me froggy armor? There's another stable here. Checking them all. It's gonna be like thirty. It's. It could actually be, like, literally every single one. It's gonna take so long to do. It's gonna take so long. At least we get paid for doing the jobs. Oh. The birds are starving in the village. Hmm. It is a mountain of a beast too, with large, huge, brutal tusks. The little reporters have never seen something so frightening. Princess herself was controlling this terrifying. Don't mm. tell me I have to fight a Lionel. Huh? Guess at this table we'll talk about some kind of rumored beast. There have been a number of sites of the subtropical region in the south. Huh. Oh no! Don't. Don't tell me it's a Lionel. The legendary weapon. Mm -hmm. Rumored beast you're after, that's, what, that's just a story. Go to any stable in Hyrule and you'll find people excited about the rumored beast. Tables are place where information gathers. Oh. Okay, where, where, where is it and the weapon? It's for the froggy armor. Signs of the rumored beast in the subtropical region to the south. That's so. That's all the way over here. <laughs> it's gonna take the entire game to get this froggy armor. It's, it's gonna take. Like, you have to beat it. Oh no. Okay, no, I'm going to the village. I'm going to the village. We'll get we'll get round to it, but not today. There's no way. You want to beat the game or frog? <laughs> I just, I, I can't right now. We, we've been putting off this village for so damn long. Gotta help the people out. Please just give me like a piece of it. I helped with a job.
Ah, oh, damn it. Damn you. Okay, wait. Hang on. What was the story? With the stable, was it... Was it this one? Which one was it? I think it was this one, yeah. I need to see if I can unlock the fairy. I'll help the village! <laughs> I'll help the village! Get that, there's, look, there's a lot happening. Need to get the band back together here. Ah, oh, he's here as well. I'm going through it one more time just so I make sure I have all the details correct. Happened that night when the great fairy hid herself away. Her accident here. She had her accident here one awful night sometime after the upheaval. The other great fairy nearby vanished from view. It was troubling someone. We got in the, our wagon to go, go to her. Oh, this is going to restore it, isn't it? The woman with blonde hair jumped out in front of us. The horse bolted away. Off it ran into the night. No. The real tragedy. That involved one of the most crucial members of our troop. Our beloved Breezer. I think I just have to fix another wagon. No, no. I feel like there's been like three different jobs with like, can you fix my wagon? Okay. I mean, this help. This helps us. We're getting closer to the frog. We can do this too. Hmm. Oh. Okay, we need to fix the wagon. Ah. This is gonna give us like double the amount of armor the moment we get this. Protective blessings on travelers. Hmm. Only way to weigh the reacher. Yeah, hang on. I, I just need to find, like, the extra... Yeah, yeah, there's always, like, four of them. Around the place. <laughs> hang on, I'll, 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 I'll give that a do-over in a moment, right? But there's always one car, one wheel on the shopping trolley, right? Oh. Ah. Oh. I'll take you. He's made some sort of change to Breezer. We may be able to be on our way now. Quick, let's get in. We wouldn't want to be left behind. Okay, hang on. Let me get up. Let me get my horse. Oh. Oh. Touch a harness. Oh. Oh. They, they talk so much. No, I gotta, I gotta back up. Here we go. Yeah, we gotta take him to the fountain. Which way is the fountain again? They, they actually signposted. No, that's Goron City. It's just up the road there.
It's moving. It's working. <laughs> the wagon's in perfect condition once again. Chopping Trolley's gonna make it, gang. Don't worry. Thank you, we can take it from here. All right, Maestro, lead us into the performance. Let's play with all the heart we can for the great fairy. Give us a song. I feel like we're listening to like civilization music. Upgrade all of our equi equipment now, please. We have to find more of a panda. It looks like there's a lot of space in that wagon. Hey, how's it going? Yeah, yeah. The old violin, the great fairy, graces us with her presence. Uh, this counts as frog progress. Ah. Look at this, you really helped out here, partner. Threw as fast as I could when I saw the bud opening up. We get money for it, too. Mm -hmm. Couldn't resist coming out to bask in your beautiful music. But I'm outside to see the world is not at all how Princess Zelda described it to me. It warned me that an awful gloom was spreading over the land and that the world would soon be lost to monsters. I myself away. Mm. I looked back on it while Princess Zelda was speaking to me. I had a feeling something wasn't right. In the deep dark of that night, I couldn't see her face clearly. Maybe it was someone else entirely. Mm. Looked like Zelda, but she wasn't Zelda. Okay, tie, tie, tie. It's time for the Lucky Gazette. Mm. Beyond the case. We work together to chase two of the stories relating to Princess Zelda. Here's some more money. Lucky Clover Gazette fabric. Oh, you can recolor the paraglider. That's that's cute. We have to get up. We have not been to Hatano or anywhere like that yet. We'll get over there eventually. It's okay, so long. Zelda's evil twin Schmelda. <laughs> Fucking Schmelda. <laughs> ah, God. I taught the rest of our musicians after the troop because they didn't like how I play my violin. <gasps> Wasn't it at all? You have the heart of the great fairy yourself with your violin. Your playing is impeccable. <laughs> yes, I really did do that, didn't I? Heard the other great fairies are also hiding away in their buds. <sighs> I bet if you, I mean, if we play music for them, that'd cheer them up too. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so, yep, yeah, so I have to get another one. I've, I found your hornist. <laughs> He's been looking to meet up with you. If we find another great fairy, then we should have two. Hmm? Okay. Hey, how's it going? There's four of us across this land. Huh? Find my sisters in the flower buds. They're as scared as I was to come out of hiding. Uh, Mija is near the stable in Hebra. We could go there. Kesa is near the stable in Hyrule Field. Otera is near the stable in West Nikluda. Mm -hmm. We could get two of them easy. And we already have the Hornist. Oh. Hands mm -hmm. are close. Oh no, these are quite... That requires Farish's scale? Cannot even enhance that item. We don't have basic rush rooms. Oh no, we have like nothing. I can get just straight up armor. I can get basic armor with these. Mm. Upgrade Aww. this. <sighs> I'm gonna have to do some material farming at some point.
Real shame you cooked all the rush rooms. I, <laughs> I did, yeah, I had like so many of them. Mm. Huh. The great fairy isn't strong enough. I, I'm mm. just gonna enhance everything mm. for now. Please go to Reno now. <laughs> We're getting there. We just have to go to the other great fairy first though. We might be able to upgrade our armor oh. even further. Huh? Mm. Mm. Huh? All of our gear is moving up in the world. Mm. Does it cost money too? Mm. Cost ten. Okay. Small little commission fee. Oh, huh? Okay. We need we need to go see the other fairy then. With our hornist. We'll get there. If for at least for the time being. I know this offers, like, fuck all in the way of benefits, but it's also 15 armor. We can- we can stay alive more with this. And that's reason enough to use it. Oh, I've only had the frog armor. It's gonna be raining here the rest of the day. So they're just marked on the map now. Like, I'm so close to this one. I'm so close. Like, we... It's just up the road. It's just a short trip up the road, guys. The other shrine was closer. No, the other the other shrine's in a temple. Like you can't you can't go from there. That was underground. Oh no, there's no stable here. Okay, it's just up the road though, right? Okay, hang on, wait, what what can I do? I can make this work. I got a fan as well. The main component's gonna be the rocket. We have to get this right, okay? We're gonna put this here. It's gonna be at an angle. Okay, hang on. Let, let, let's position ourselves towards the fountain. <laughs> Okay. Is this- is this on the right spot? Look, it works with the Korok, right? It can work here. Save it here. Oh, we don't have enough lift. We don't have enough lift. Okay, but wait, we I can make more lift. I got Oh Bollocks. <laughs> hey, come on, come on. Ease it up. Ease it up.
Now we just have to climb the cliff. <laughs> yeah, let me put on my climbing gear. I might need it again. All it cost us was two rockets. Cube up there. Okay. You know, I just like having the calm sometimes. You know, that's what, that's what it's really about. Didn't even get close. How my parents described their walk to school. <laughs> Basically, yeah. I, I could rocket shield from here. Maybe. I don't think there's any need. Put on, put on your boots. Let's keep on going. <laughs> not gonna make it. I'm not gonna. <laughs> Stamina food. This is what we made like the the mushroom skewer for. Can't really ascend here because we need to be on like a flat surface initially. Ascend's good for like a short height, like a short hop. All good. Let him cook, chat. I'm seeing that phrase more and more. <laughs> okay. Some kind of settlement over here. Here's the fairy. Got him. <laughs> Give me a sapphire sword. There's another stable here. This may even help us with the frog arm. Sure. Take it. Why is there like so many places? Like, oh, it's just the towers again. They all have spotlights now. Okay. They really want to make them clear for you. I, I don't know if I can be arsed to help you right now. <laughs> just... Alright, hang on. Where, where, where are you off to, bud? Just the darkness. Okay. Alright, I can see the smoke. If I could toss him down the hill a bit, it would make it easier. I roll him? Oh, I don't have any wind on me at the moment. I'm not putting another rocket on him. <laughs> We've only one rocket left. Okay, we'll walk him over. This one's not too bad. K. 
can you attack him with the Arios? Ha hang on. If this works, guys, it's like, like trust me. It's worth it. I need to see. Okay, bring him back to the stable. The band's here. The horn has made his way here too. Okay, I, I need a horse. Give me another reward too, sure. Oh, I sorry, I did that wrong. I'll do it again. Hey, look, I'm just gonna hazard a guess that like at least like half of people playing this game are torture in the Koroks. Oh, <laughs> it's like why wouldn't you? Oh, oh, huh? Oh, oh. 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 Okay, buddy. <laughs> this is perfect. We never have to worry about him again. We don't even need the wagon. It's more efficient. Next time I'll make sure to sell a tip to the underside of it. There's my friend. <laughs> Not a Korok yet. Oh, there's a cave over here, too. We're getting so distracted. We have to visit the cave over here. We will get to the village. We're close to it now, alright? How many times have we changed, like, what we're currently doing? Like, a current objective. Around ten times. It's, it's just important. I just, uh... There for some reason. Yeah, that works. Yeah. This game enhances ADHD. <laughs> oh, I want some of these. I can actually get them this time because they're not over like a body of water or anything. Stock up on a few. Hey, friend. How you doing? Pretty good. I haven't found your man who wants these in a while. I have so many saved up from. 
wonder if the fairies respawn. This is a good fairy grind room. I believe fairies do respawn. I know, like, around some of the fairy fountains, like, they're, they just consistently there. At least in Breath of the Wild. So I imagine it's, it's the same. How's this been compared to Breath of the Wild so far? I, I think this is just a better game. Honestly. The physics systems are much more fun. I think it'd be hard to, to j justify otherwise. It's just so much more happening here. Who is the bomb power though? You have that. It's just it's just now like a, a, a single item, but you still have bombs like as a system in that. Dragon? Oh good lord, okay, that might be scary. Again, uh, we're still getting to the village, we have to do this. And then we talk to them, we bring them up, and then it's time for the village. And I'll have just about an hour left until Eurovision. So we're gonna get it all done today, gang, don't worry. Only taken six hours to get this far. With our initial objective. Oh god. I think I got him. Is there anything else I can do? Just lasers. I'm worried those will instantly kill me or do something horrible. Go up here. <laughs> Must ascend. Need to get in there. Just land on top of here. Uh, they've got like a mini dungeon laid out for me. I mean, it's cute. Oh, I botched that a little. All right. Portals. We're just like breaking out of bounds. Even here. Soldier Construct 2 Horn. Leveled up a little bit. Let's refer her out. Sturdy wooden stick. Uh, it might be better than. I mean, we just have a torch. Keep that. Apply something to it later. Those don't know Eurovision is where we got the epic sax guy from. <laughs> Possibly the biggest claim to fame for Eurovision, yeah. It's true. The only context necessary. Go for a stroll. God. This game really feels like a more complete version of Breath of the Wild. I mean, Breath of the Wild already was complete, though. You have to remember that. But, like, th this is this is just expanding on it and doing more.
Like, if you could only play one, like, probably why wouldn't you pick this one? Like, only reason I could really see is just story, you know, but that's, like, always a preference thing. Um, where is this thing? Uh, do I need to ascend? How do I get in there? I just break it out? I needed a key somewhere. I don't see the key. I just getting through the door? I, th I thought I needed a key. Yeah, I do. Where's the key? Is it possible to de descend? You go down two or only up? Only up. I feel like there'll be too much that could go wrong with just going down all the time. You just end up in some, like, deadly cavern. Um, I, I'm not seeing where the key is, gang. Does anyone else see it? Or, like... I actually don't see where this is supposed to be. There's a glider in here. I think I get it. I'm I'm not seeing it, yeah. Want a tip? Yeah, I mean if anyone actually knows, like I, I genuinely don't see how what you're supposed to do here. Oh, wait, there's a trap door for some reason. Okay. People just tell me to die to the lasers. Like, he's like, come on. There's a trap door, yeah. Just didn't see it. Small key. Swim. Only I was touching the lasers, that's all of it though. No, you just have to stand in the middle of it. I think the lasers would just hurt you. Just to look at the floor there and realize that's what's happening. Okay. Bring this upstairs. Was the laser you touched it? I sure. Then I, I did. We got it anyway. Sure, it's all good. Yeah. Now, how does this help me? What's? I mean, it wants me to set it up here. Which is like, okay, sure. Huck. 
put the ball on it. Is it the same size ball? Oh, I thought it was looking for a bigger ball. Okay. Yeah, then we're fine. Away we go. We. <laughs> Gotta grab it. Yeah, let's just put our kite in here for a moment. There we go. Okay, yeah, that was that was a weird one. Now it's finally time to get the ferry, and then we go to the village. We're so close on this. For once, it wasn't a long stick. I do love, like, how half the puzzles can be solved with that. Like, it's so funny to me. Okay, let's hop over here. Ario, you gotta turn a bit. Ario just likes to fight me, I think. <laughs> Can't take her anywhere. Hope that's good enough. Okay, let's hop on over. I know you, traveler. We've had a delightful development. Look! This is Estus, and he's ho his horn. He and his horn are back in our troop. Heartbreaking to think of the poor fellow getting stuck in a hole on the way to Rito Village. Estus doesn't get to drive the cart anymore. Oh, I'm glad he got out of his funk and fit as a fiddle. Yeah, let's go pay a visit. Get through the snow. Great fairy is hiding inside her flower bud. She's too frightened to come out. Okay. We might fall ill in such weather. They try to attach a roof to Breezer. Oh, okay, we need we need to make sure they're secure. Hang on. Don't worry, gang, I gotcha. a little more lent. You want to make sure they're really sheltered. <laughs> I'll take you. It needs a roof to keep off the snow. <laughs> they don't believe me. Yeah, it's okay. We still have some more materials. Hang on. Okay, how's that? <laughs> She's just not happy. It's garbage. Yeah, hang on, I'll, I'll make him a roof.
Pop all these on. Doesn't appreciate my craftsmanship. <laughs> Just wait, because we're going to balance it out. There we go, it's perfect. I'll take ya. <laughs> the wheels! <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah, hang on. Just in case we start to tip over a bit, right? I'm gonna have to stick these on the side. And then I'll just put like an additional wheel on the bottom of these. We, we need stabilizers for this one. We don't want it to fall over. Yeah, you know, we have the extra wheels, so we might as well just make it symmetrical. <laughs> They're screaming! <laughs> we haven't even taken off yet. Yikes. <laughs> Okay, hang on, gang, hang on. I'm just lining you. I'm just. I'm j I just need to get you on the road. Okay, hang on, we just need to get it fastened now. Line it up. It's not a good angle. Okay, there we Okay, we're ready to hit the road, gang. The camera has to zoom so far back because of the size. I can't see. <laughs> it's rocking so. <laughs> it's rocking and shaking so bad. <laughs> no, they're they're just gonna leave us be. Gotta go, we gotta go slow. Ario's having none of it. They're making it. Goddamn contraption. Thank God we put the stabilizers on. It would have already like fallen over. Come on, Ario. She's really struggling. <laughs> Just hang on. Hang on, we're almost there. Stable trotters have arrived.
This baby is 0.5 horsepower behind. It's just less. Yeah, second great fairy unlocked. This is really good in terms of just the amount of armor it's gonna give. It's like another step of up what we want. Hey, how's it going? Exactly as the developers intended. <laughs> Yeah, they must have had to move the Great Fairy locations, because one was in the desert before, in Breath of the Wild. So it just wouldn't have made sense. Uh. What divine presence, what splendor. Oh. Okay, we must return to the stable to share the good news. This might count as a frog, like, a uh, frog suit quest as well. Yeah, yeah. Or, no, he's just gonna pay us outright. Yeah, yeah. Okay, oh. there's two more. Oh. Do, do the responsible thing and return your steed to a stable, yeah, don't you yeah. worry. Uh, okay, they're gonna drop Ario off as well. I need to go home. I'm gonna sellotape rockets to the next one. <laughs> I think I've already decided. I'm gonna try fly him to the fence. Oh, I need to see if that works. Oh god, hey, how's it going? Yep, enhance my clothes, please. Can't enhance anything except these ones. Still requires scales, rush room. It requires eyeballs. We used all our eyeballs on our way to Hyrule Castle. Uh, the fact that we can still get this to 8 armor apiece is amazing. That's so much protection. Sadly, I don't think this one offers any bonus. Uh, if you get it all to level 2. But we'll do it anyway. I wonder if the animations are different. I mean, I think they are a little bit. Can't quite remember, honestly. Oh, wait, did I run out? Oh no, I think I did. I don't have enough for the last one. Okay, well, I mean, we got we got some armor done. More powerful than we were. I'll take it. Okay, now it's finally time. Wait, does that recall? No. Hang on, let's, uh, let's head on back. To the stable, just make sure your man isn't there and was like, Hey, have you checked out the Great Fairy? Link is done with not going to the village. I'm only gonna be streaming like another hour. <laughs> We've still not got there. Okay. Ah. Okay, how's it going? Oh. Taking care of a very rare animal for Princess Zelda, a golden horse. Poor thing ran away from our stable. Mm. Oh. It's her horse, is it? No creature began making terrible sounds, neighing and bucking around so hard it shook the stable. Mm. There she was, Princess Zelda. Uh. So we gotta go find the golden horse. That's cool. Mm. 
ran away. Hey, don't mind me. Just sneak it in here. Should we, should we go? I mean, we could go to the village, but should we just pick up the horse real quick? Hang on. Just, you know, like, quickly pop out. Ten minute adventure. Doesn't seem to be the actual princess. Yeah, there's something, there's something wrong. With this princess. The horse galloped north. Go and search that sea, but with that huge monster that's flying around up north. We could fight a dragon gang. Hang on. Oh, we gotta fight the dragon. Yeah. Huh? Oh. <laughs> Fuck the village. Oh. 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 Huh? Oh. Oh. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. We've heard it all. It's to the west. Dragon time, let's go. We gotta, we gotta go check this out. It has a big dragon as well. Oh no. Is she kinda scared? Oh, I need some of these. Rito Village is a myth perpetuated by Big Bird. Okay, the dragon actually does kind of scare me though. This actually might be strong. Oh my god, that's massive. Can we take this? Oh my god. Oh, Jesus, Ario. Fuck. Okay, okay, no, no, we can't take it. Holy shit. Just get out of there. Ario's fine. Ario's fine. Yeah, don't don't worry. Ario will be Ario will be okay. You just summon them back in at the stable. Okay, I think we just go to the village. Holy shit! That almost instantly killed us. I I do not know how to fight that. Yeah. Oh. 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 Huh? Oh. Oh. Hmm. Oh. That was terrifying. Still have a pony point reward. You, you guys are determined for me to not get to this village. I've been trying every time, and you keep finding new things for me to do. Oh, oh. Sleep in a Melania bed, not only will you wake up more energized, Melania the horse god may also share a mystical message. You can register additional horse if I get more points. Uh, where's the bed? Is it just any of the beds in the stable? Here's like a recipe. Sleep on the god's bed. 
I don't know where that is. Ask for sleep at the desk. Yeah, yeah, it's here, ain't it? Oh. So you can just buy it. Sure. Oh. S sleep until noon. Oh. Hey, Melania, the god of horses who grants quicker hooves and thicker hides. Mm. Northeast Hyrule, near the stable in Akala, I am waiting. Okay. You can improve your horse. Horse God is out there. Hario's been praying. Oh, it's Blood Moon again. Welcome back to Bloodborne. It's like, what did you do, Horse God? Oh, you get bonus hearts as well. And you get an extra point for lodging. Cool. Oh. <laughs> Don't mind all the red everywhere. <laughs> sure it's all under control. Okay, now if I fast travel here, it does mean that Ario is going to be on her own again. But yeah, we're, we're going to the village. Extra heart so you can kill that dragon, eh? Absolutely not. I don't know what I'm supposed to do against that dragon. Like that, he was just murdering us. I vaguely remember a Zelda enemy that was like that back in the day. And they've used like a three-headed dragon in like a few boss fight encounters. But it's been a while. Ooh, I get an extra wheel of stamina from that, too. That's actually quite good. We should do that whenever we can. Wait, can I... Give me frog. Nah, she, she's just telling me to go out to the world. No frog just yet. Well, it was the first thing we said we would do today. But six hours late. Oh wait, no, the bridge. The bridge is closed. Oh. Um. Hmm. Right, well, I mean. I'm, I'm getting to this village one way or another. <laughs> Just get across this. Okay, we're in. We're not putting it off any longer. This game's not gonna stop us no more. That's like a fr cold dragon roost theme. This is the blizzard. That's actually really cool. In here, it's like all remixed. I don't think we had enough to make like a long stick across the bridge there. We'll have to go back out to the woods or something. Reserve your extra stamina. Is anyone even home? The 
bird's still living here. Little statue here. Don't quite have enough. I mean, the kids are out in full force. Got it just in time, mister. Got to practice our song. Called the Song of the Stormwind Ark. We're gonna sing it together to save our village from the upheaval. You're gonna listen to our song. Sure. When ready, a one, a two. The god fell from heaven, still in the Heber winds. The heavens grew lifeless just as the air below thin. With the world in upheaval, we pledge to help the Lord. The line of ship soared, built as a passage skyward. God ascended to heaven, even behind an ark. Its winds brought us new life, thanks to its great divine spark. Oh. Talks about the ark that saved Rito Village a long, long time ago. Something bad happened then, just like it's happening now. Oh. Yeah, it's storm and dark. Is it actually real? Oh. Papa told me it's always watching over us high in the sky. We use his help with this awful blizzard. Most of the adults aren't around anymore because of the weird weather. Ah. We don't have the ark, we don't have the adults. It's up to us kids to take care of the village. This is the only ones yeah. here. We gotta run the shop. <laughs> Kid power. Ah. Are all the adults actually gone? Yeah. I think it's just the kids left. Child labor. It's Lord of the Flies time. Oh, there's a shrine here too, Andy. Hi. Okay, here is the general store. Fish pie made with stamina and bass. Doesn't that sound yummy? Can't leave the village to catch the bass. Okay, cooking quest. Do I conveniently have it? Probably not. Cane sugar, butter. Give me all your arrows. Slippery Falcon store. Why did all the parents just abandon their children? You took too long. <laughs> the parents didn't survive. Hop in here. Ride the winds. Sure. Oh, I see what's happening. All right. There we go. Okay, okay, this- oh, this might actually get us killed. Just go slow. Just go slow. Put the flying gear. We have our flight suit. Should I break this? Guess so. Hey, bud. <laughs> you were meant to dive into it. I'm I'm not chancing that. Folks having a bad day, by the way. Do I need to get in there, or do I just go back up? There might have been more up there. Huh? 
trying to work out where I'm actually supposed to get the... I think I get in there and then I ride that up. Okay. There we go. You really think you were meant to daintly land on the ice? <laughs> Look, I'm not- I'm not chancing like the moving fans, right? The easiest way to instantly die is just by falling. Like, it- it can just kill you. I'm not taking that chance. I have to play it cautious. We've lost one toe already. God damn it. Dave here? Oh, it's just a Korok. Yeah. We're hiding from the blizzard here. Yeah. Oh, they still have the cold resist gear, don't they? It's 500 rupees a piece. But it does offer three as a base, which when you upgrade it is going to be actually quite good. We might just want to get it. 650, 500, 1,000! It's going to be 2,000 rupees to get it all. I'm so poor. The kids jacked up the prices. What, can I- do I even have enough to sell? I have that diamond, but I, I don't really want to sell that. Opal has the power of water. We haven't even tried that on anything. Sell all the amber. Never using that anyway. I just don't have enough. So some of the monster guts and that. Like, I... I don't really want to, like... I need rubies and stuff like that. The Rito economy is in shambles. It's so good, though, is the thing. I'm not selling, like, these, these gains from, like, the, the end of the game. Like, these are so much more valuable to actually using a weapon. I nothing really sells for a lot outside of the gems. Like, even though I sell all that, it's 550, 700. I only get about a thousand gold. Or rupees. Maybe sell meals. The, the meals aren't worth much. You can sell this dubious food. <laughs> You can sell armor? How- How bad do you want it, chat? <laughs> you can sell armor? I didn't know you could do that. Absolutely not anything but the fashion. Hi. It'll pay a lot for those ores. If I can even get the snow cool tunic, I'll be in better shape, won't I? That one's only 500, okay. Huh? So we'll get that. Yeah. I can sell a rupee. A ruby. Hi. Yeah. 
Okay, so we have one piece. It's nice, because now we can equip that one instead, and it gives us more armor overall. That's cool. We're poor now. I'll try and save up some money and we can eventually get that. It's so expensive. Just a bunch of hammocks. Anything in here we can pilfer? Pot lid. Booking station. A single buck to your name. We're working on it, right? We needed the cold resist. Like one step at a time. Prism solid. I told me you can use ice fruits to freeze monsters. I picked some earlier. Time check. We're, go we're going till half seven. Uh, and then I'm hopping off. To get ready to watch Eurovision. Oh, she's telling you about arrows and stuff like that. This is a thank you present. Cheers. The world famous arrow maker. One my papa can be proud of. Rivali's Landing. Oh, I remember this. Hang on, what's up here, though? Anything more? Oh my god, there's adults still here. That's not fair at all. You know I can handle it. Oh, a cutscene. Checking out that huge cloud wouldn't be hard. I could even do it alone. Hmm. It's your man from if we don't from do anything before. the village huh? Huh? is that you <laughs> it is you Link! hey how's it going Tulin young Rito warrior he's growing up a bit yeah Mm. Teb is here again as well. I think they told me you were missing. It's good to see you doing so well. The new Rito Elder. <laughs> oh, he's just getting on in years. Very nice to see you again. Hmm. For my son Tulin, he's grown taller, though perhaps not yet grown up. Uh. If you didn't treat me like a hatchling all the time. <laughs> you still think you can take on the world by yourself? You'll always be my little chick. Mm. Oh, he's going to be really bratty, isn't he? I'll keep wasting your time treating the song of the storm of dark like it's real, but it's not not me. I'm sure he's gonna be in no incredible danger soon. <laughs> Unbelievable. He wants me to wants to let him go find what's causing the blizzard, and he's having trouble here. And no. Song. I'm going to face a different sort of upheaval. The village was saved thanks to a great flying ship. So claims the song has been passed down through generations. Hmm. Song for children, mind you. A few adults still parrot it as if it were true. Every now and then you get reports among the Rito of a flying ship. Uh, the blizzard caused by this upheaval and seems less far fetched. Oh, we just gotta go into the cloud, yeah. Even if the song of the storm and arc is just a children's rhyme, I suspect that there is something lurking high in the sky. The air is so turbulent now that no Rito can fly close enough to look into it. I say we need to make careful preparations to find the troop, but Tulin thinks we cling to that song out of cowardice. Hmm. These are Rito matters. You came for some purpose, yes? I'm here to resolve Rito matters. <clears throat> Zelda's disappearance and the strange phenomena around the world are related somehow. Mm. Your Rito would ordinarily love to contribute to your search. The normal blizzard shows no sign of stopping and food is growing scarce. What I could spare is already out researching the blizzard or scavenging for food. Mm. Children have taken over the town. <laughs> He's actually the actual village elder now, bless him. 
Huh. Try asking Hart. See the two bonfires. We're gonna have to climb that mountain, aren't we? Hmm. Let's go. See you later, gang. Tulin's profile has been added. Eva's profile. See that mountain? You can climb it. I feel like Breath of the Wild is what Todd Howard like kind of, kind of wanted Skyrim to be in some respect. In terms of just how open and free it is, because Skyrim like, like it, it is open, but like also not really at points. You get like stuck. Oh, he's gone. It's like a different setup. Bye, loot. I'll just see what's in here. It's a puddle. Crayon skill issue. God, you're ma like he's not even wearing a jacket or anything. What are you doing out here? <laughs> like, buddy, buddy, go home. I did it. Hang on. It's the wrong button. You 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 gotta go get warm or something. President's doing well. He ate a lot of chili peppers to be here. <laughs> He's just like down in a bottle of hot sauce to keep warm. He's desperately trying to survive. At least wear sleeves, you fool. Like, that's the thing. He doesn't even have that. Absolutely desperate. Alright, here because you spot the bonfires. Hey, yeah, how's it going? Can't beat the spotlight set up around that fancy sky view tower. We should probably walk oh. over to that at some point. Oh, if we oh. use that, we might be able to just go into the sky. Figure out what's going on. Ah. And these strange things at the foot of the Heber Mountains are oddly shaped, aren't they? Mm. I've done every test I can think of, but I haven't learned anything. Not that they, you know what they're made of or what they're for. Pretty heavy and pretty sharp. Uh, I've got all I'm going to get out of these things. If you want them for some reason, they're yours. Like here's like some c supplies for the road ahead. <laughs> Break everything open. <laughs> Taking it all. Let me, let me just take your oil. Mine now. Oh, spicy peppers for dinner. Neat. Don't mind if I do. Oh. Uh. <sighs> okay, everyone's struggling because it's cold. There's sky monsters. Oh. Maybe Tulin could help. <laughs> we went around for it, but little Tulin has developed a way with wings that puts the adults to shame. Even in the vicious weather, he patrols the skies and reports all kinds of useful information. Oh. His wind gust technique is something to see. None of the rest of us can pull it off. Even Stern Teba acknowledges that Tulin's skill is a cut above. Mm. It does preen about it more than he should, but well, it's worth asking him at least. 
Does he just have Revali's Gale now? Oh no, that means like the kid's gonna be really important, isn't he? Oh no. I didn't mind Teva so much. Uh. Not the child. And the bonfire at the matter of the cave, and you'll be on your way to find Tulin. Ah. Uh, everyone's just <laughs> cooking. Spicy pepper keeps you warm. Important. I just remember, like, the Goron guy was, like, kind of awful before. As far as, like, the child characters went. <laughs> he just kind of sucked. You know, I'm wary. Wait, its entrance is marked with another bonfire. Oh, wait, hang on. That over there? No, those are just moblins. It's up here, isn't it? Gotta be up here. Yeah, here it is. The mountain we go. Trying to pick up along the way, too. Mm. I believe that these huge things are raining down on us. What's happening up there in the skies? Can I rewind it? Mm. We're very cold. Ah. Cave entrance is here. Thank you, friend. Ooh. Yeah, we're fair and okay, thankfully. Doesn't seem too bad. Because we already have, like, cold gear. Have so much food in the wings. I think I already know what the boss of this area is gonna be, because we may have seen him. <laughs> in the final boss fight. Might have been the only one that we actually know about. Oh. I'm just falling over a lot. <laughs> Feathered edge. Uh, we could take one of them. Actually, no, I, I actually have... I actually have high durability stuff. I probably don't want to. It is a wind sword, though. Yeah, it is a wind sword. It might be worth while picking up. I actually have, like, good fundamental sort of stuff. Sticks are... Like, this is, like, the most valuable find. Like, oh my god, I found a stick. You just attach something insane to it. I'll come back for the tower. The people of this village have suffered long enough. That we got it. We got to try climb this mountain. Is this the cave they mentioned? The fire. Make the diamond sword. South Summit Cave. Hey, I'm looking for a small child who charged up the mountain. I'm not gonna show you the way. <laughs> You're on your own. It's like, oh, okay. There we go. Fish have nowhere to run. They can wait another week. <laughs> like, yeah, you guys have survived this long already. Like, it can't be that bad. It just... 
go find like four more stables, well, like 20 more stables or whatever. Hello there. When will you stream Zelda again after today? Tomorrow. Tomorrow is also Zelda. I, it, honestly, the, the stream's the next while it's Zelda. I, I've been wanting to play this for so long and I'm having such an amazing time. Oh my god. A little scared just because I thought I thought like it was gonna be like a you got a burp Charlie scene there. <laughs> Pen demise. Why are you even in I thought we had this cave. I thought it was safe. What are you doing in there? I wonder what mechanic they want you to use here. Oh wait, there's no there's actually no updraft. Uh I mean, if I light enough fires, maybe? Get a balloon. Is it really- is that really, really what it wants me to do? I don't really have any foundation for a balloon. Three wood fires makes an updraft. Okay, hang on, then let me... Let me search for wood. Hang on one sec. It's gonna be right at the end, isn't it? <laughs> no, where was it? Okay. Uh, <laughs> let's get another one. <laughs> That's not nearly enough. <laughs> Maybe I can just climb it? I think I can just climb it. <laughs> Only you had the spring lock shield. Some of you have not let that spring shield go. <laughs> like, I had like no reason to keep it. And like every time since then, it's like, should have kept it then. I swear to God. We're good. Hey friends. How far up did he go? You guys know the cave is completely overrun with monsters, yeah? There's a Hylian doing all the way up here in such a fierce blizzard. If I just go through the rock, am I gonna just end up where he is? He might be in the cave still. This cave ahead north, you can spot a lone cedar tree on Talanto Peak. So we saw the monsters. A lone tree. Looking for the nest. He's trying to deal with them all. 
I have a feeling he's gonna be get us involved with uh whatever's in the sky too. Sneaking suspicion. What are you doing here? Dude dude, there's monsters like just over there. Why are you here? Okay. I got I gotta help him with his sign or this guy's gonna actually die. It's a cult. <laughs> Boulder. Get, I don't. I don't know what tools you want, bud. Just, just go home. Just go home. <laughs> Hudson's gonna be the final boss. It's just the president. That'd be amazing. And he's like the hardest boss in the game. I get like one of those Square Enix CEO boss fights. I think this is thanks. <laughs> More cold resist. Ah! Puff shroom. Whoa. Okay, we're looking for a lone tree. That's a flag. I just follow the trees? There's like another one here. Is that it? Lone cedar tree. Don't see any other ones. He skipped the quest, but he gets the sign. <laughs> north, he said. Yeah, so that's to the north. We have priorities, right? Grab his mushrooms. new tools. Hey RT, I heard you dropped the spring shield. Can you rewind so I can join in on the joke? <laughs> not even a joke. This is not even... Oh, a new, new RT game uh, Twitch meme just dropped. He, uh, he left the spring shield behind. <laughs> How is it even funny? Someone's saying ham again. I thought we moved past this. There's gotta be something good in here. You know, smart man. Drop this close to it. Just set this on fire once. Oh, it's just an enemy. <laughs> okay. Sure. Oh, you can see like the entry point to this place over there too. It's actually it's actually on the mountain. We're going to go right up into the storm. Okay, 
How you doing, man? I think there's like a single shrine or ending this entire time, have we? We're really high up. Stupid monster. A rotten monster took my good bow. Oh no. Okay, I'll, I'll, hang on, I'll, I'll, I'll snipe him down. Did you know I can blow a strong gust of wind anywhere I feel like? I'll do it for you too, that way you can glide over the where that monster went. Just tell me where to point the gust and I'll make it for you. Tulin's aura is charged, you can create a stream of wind that blows straight forward. It's going to use a burst of speed while power gliding. Okay. Leave it to me. Okay, that's interesting. So it's like horizontal. More than anything. He's just following me. Got him. <laughs> oh. There we go. You my bow might have been lost for good. Backup is suddenly here. They've got paratroopers. <laughs> Yeah, just, just set them all on fire. Is he actually helping fight? Oh my god, you're, you're doing more than a lot of the companion characters already. He's actually getting them. He goes for headshots too. I'm pleasantly surprised. He's helped us more than a lot of people in this game. I think this thing might have been a hideout for those monsters. Oh. Is that the wind? Must have been. There's no way. Must have been something else. Do a link. Gang's coming to say hey. Some impressive teamwork, you two. It's all a heart. Talk about embarrassing. I didn't listen when uh, Gassan tried to stop me. I thought I could handle it. Ended up losing my favorite boat of those stupid things. It's an emo bird. He really is, yeah. Hmm. Yeah, gang is here. You're right. It's really important to work as a flock. You finally get what Dad has been trying to tell me all this time. Hmm. It doesn't like you to let you, you to let your bow be taken, Tulin. A funny story about that, there was this whole thing with Princess Zelda. I spotted her getting attacked by a monster. It was such a surprise that I dropped my guard and it stole my bow. I guess she was fine because then she zoomed up above that cloud. Uh -huh. Yeah, so like, we, we still don't really know what's going on uh -huh. with Zelda or Schmelda. Investigate the cloud. Uh. Blizzard has come from inside that cloud after all. <sighs> I want to see for myself as soon as I can, but the strong winds make any approach from the sides impossible. The only way is in through the top. There's not a Rito alive capable of crossing the stormy sky and making it all the way there. Well, except for one. Uh. Talking about you, Tulin. Only you have a skill in training to create gusts at will. Tulin will be the finest Rito warrior of all once he understands the value of working with his allies. Uh. You know, said that to me, your old dad, Teba. Huh. Oh. Make sure he knows what you accomplished here today. It's time you go with Link to find Princess Zelda and whatever's causing this blizzard. Uh -huh. Oh, we got, we're gonna have like an ally for a while. Okay. Oh. Counting on yous. So like, he's just with us and he's ready to go with Gus. And we gotta use this power to basically get across.
takes a while for him to activate. Leave it to me. Yeah. It's really different. Yeah. So we go up here, and then we're gonna get him to do another gust. He's a HM slave. He can fly for here too, so he doesn't have much trouble getting anywhere. Uh, Zonite sword. I feel like I could. I don't need it. And he basically always positions it so that he can do that for you. He's an HM friend. It really is like Ravioli's girl, but sideways, yeah. Yeah, let's go. Can I aim him to go up? Or is it only sideways? I don't think I can, yeah, I think it's only sideways. That's alright. We can make it work. It's like horror show of a stage is coming up. Oh my god. Yeah, it's just we're, we're just a platformer now. We gotta make it all the way. I could just get a rocket. For your consideration, what if we just make a ship? What equipment have I got? Fan wing. I have a balloon? Dan, you're a vegetarian. Yeah, it's, it's fine. I, guys, it doesn't start till 8. It's fine. You don't, you don't need to be like my parents. <laughs> With this stuff where it's like, make sure you're on time, young man. Like, you don't- I- I'm fully capable. Of keeping an eye on it. Can't take that out here. They thought about it. They don't want you doing that. Wait. No, maybe they didn't. I just need something I can fasten to it now. And here's some shield boards over here. <laughs> Wait, they even have a balloon here. Oh, they wanted us to do it this way. Okay. Let's pick them all off. They must have beat out the goblins that were living here. Get his help, and he is. Oh, they didn't get them at all. Come on. Okay, we can assemble a hot air balloon from here. It may not let me take out the glider, but it will let me do this. This. Do I need to sellotape a second one on, or is one enough? 
I think one's enough. You just need enough space in front of you for the glider. Is that why it didn't let me take it out? I need this, I think, for the fire source. <laughs> It's pretty bad. I wonder, is the glue blocking it? Trying to see if I can get this to work. I want to just fly to the top. Could just put wood and light a fire. I could just put multiple bits of wood. Open this holds up now. Oh my god, we have flight. Okay, this this might work. Okay, now I should take off the pot. Because that's just adding weight. Bye, pot. And what I need to do as a precaution... I need to keep other fires afloat so that we don't just run out of heat on our ascent. In case they burn down. It's also going to create an updraft which is also going to catapult the balloon. To further heights. Okay, there's a shrine up here. That's what that's our goal. We just oh god, this is dangerous. We're so high up. Working though. Wait, what does that mean? Okay, how do I attach a second balloon? <laughs> I don't know what to do! <laughs> it's not gonna explode, is it? <laughs> oh, Jesus! Uh, Gust! <laughs> okay, it got us a little bit of the way. No, you, you could really help us out here. This is gonna be a long climb. <laughs> How much stamina food do I have? Oh, uh, I need to... Not die.
Ascend, ascend never works the way you guys wait. It might here. I was thinking that like you guys want me to just use it at the like, top there, on the side of it. No, you can do it here. Up we go. Around here, I saw Princess Zelda. Mm. I don't know where she could have gone. Oh? This is Sky Ship. Oh my god, are we actually gonna get this? Oi! Wait for me. Oh? Look at that. It's a boat. Oh, he's getting one of these visions again. Come. Come. To me. Hey, how's it going? Oh, you can see the ship through the storms. <gasps> see that thing that's inside the cloud? It's that another boat, but it's huge. Tons of those little flying boats, too. You know what it reminds me of? Hmm. A line of ships soar and built as a passage skyward. God ascend to heaven and leaving behind an ark. This is the ark that he left behind for us. We must go further beyond. There's nowhere to go but up. Oh, but there's also a shrine! We gotta get the shrine! Oh! Oh, oh. Yes. It's not what I expected. I, I thought I was gonna, like, take the ship and make my way up that way. It's a trampoline! So cool. Okay, we have to we have to wrap up the stream for tonight, unfortunately. We will pick this up tomorrow and we'll just keep going. We'll just keep going. Uh because I'm having a great time. Eurovision's on tonight. Starts at the top of the hour. I'm hopping off. I mean, that's a good point to call it. But thank you so much everyone for coming by the stream today. I hope you all enjoyed it as ever. Thank you to everyone who gave bits, thank you to everyone who gave subs, thank you to mods has ever been on hand. Hope you all had a good one. Eurovision time, let's go. Yes, have you never seen Eurovision? Just for, because I know there's like a good few, a good few folks who aren't familiar with it here. Uh, it's the, it's like a European song contest. It's a lot of fun, there's a lot of drama. Basically, like there's performing acts for every country here. It's fun. It's very entertaining. Uh, I'm getting together with some friends, and we're gonna have a few drinks and just kind of watch and just have a good time. Europe and Australia. Yeah, there's always a few folks that are just aren't in Europe there, but it's like, it's fine. <laughs> We've kind of just like added more people on as the years have gone on. It's just wildly entertaining. Are you voting for this year? I haven't seen anyone yet. So. Gotta sit tight. Yeah, I'm I'm quite excited for it though. It's gonna be a good time. I'll see. Uh, I don't know whose care can I leave you in that might not be watching it. Most people I know are gonna be stopping their stream soon to watch this tonight. I actually don't know whose care to leave you in. I have no idea. I'll let you disperse amongst yourselves. Yeah, I think that's just the easiest. You guys go your own ways. Do it that way. Okay, actually, wait, hang on. No, Shadow is actually streaming Zelda. So Shadow might not be one. Shadow is from Ye Canada. 
She might be watching it too, honestly. I don't know. I always recommend it. Okay, thanks for coming, folks. I'll see y'all tomorrow. More Zelda then. We'll figure out what's going on here. Have a good night. Take care.